he feels sometimes like he's just outnumbered with all these Koreans. I have to call in backup. So we got just a couple questions related to the fit Korean culture side of things. Who got the bigger schmidt? I don't know what it is, but I genuinely do not like Asian friend groups. Because most of y'all just like y'all's parents. Toxic, gossipers, and rude. Oh, damn. damn! Can I tell you the first thing uh, that facts, I thought though, of, though? What? Yeah. That's yeah, how are you into that? Do you prefer your men to throw on you? Yes, actually. Yes. I do like a juicy fat. A nice grab is just like, you know, in the morning, just... Damn. My life is round. Hey, uh, on our show, we actually don't allow phones. So like, oh, my fault, dog. Oh, damn. Crazy. Right. I know you're new to this and everything, but Thank this you, is under the influence. Thank you for having us. Okay. Yeah, no problem. Thank you. I'm from New Jersey. Oh, okay. Fucking <laughs> fuck. <laughs> you, who talk? <laughs> Shut up, Nina. You talk too much. <laughs> <laughs> She's right, taking this very seriously. Good, good? I'm starting to believe that. Sorry, Wu Talk. Start, started up, yeah, Ms. Mr. Wu Talk, the guesser. All right, All right, thank you, thank you, Nina. All Where right, we Wait, that's enough for today. Yeah. Oh, that one? That's your camera. Oh, okay, that's our camera. Got it, got it, got it. <laughs> Jeremy, can you pass me a coaster? Hey, we're Jeremy, can you pass me a coaster? <laughs> yeah, wait, now. <laughs> you tweaking me out, call me Jeremy. Is Hey, this is your show. You gotta run it. You gotta tell people to shut know, up. No, no, you're starting. Start whenever. Start whenever. Yeah, start whenever. Yeah, show. You gotta set, keep people. Go. Welcome back to Under the Influence. You're watching the juiciest juice again. Juice again. I'm sorry. The <laughs> <laughs> talk is breaking up. I can't say it. Okay. One take. All right. Welcome back to Under the Influence. You're watching the juiciest show on the internet. I'll be your host for today. My name is Wu Talk. That was so great, Wu Talk. You're just so great. Thank you. Shut up, Nina. That's enough. Where are you from, Wu Talk? I'm from New Jersey. But very close to New York, right? No, New Jersey. That is not New York, but New Jersey. <laughs> Basically New York. It's like Basically. a wannabe New York, but it's just New Jersey. Yeah, yeah. Close enough. I'm okay. your guest host, Jeremy. Co-guest host, Vit. And uh, these are our special guests for today. Please introduce yourselves. Yes, go ahead. My name is Bachi. Say, say that again. My name is Bachi. My name is Nina. I'm, I'm the Peter Bully. <laughs> it's me, Wu Talk. <laughs> no, you're Esther. It's the oh, it's I thought I Wu Talk. What's going on? <laughs> it's me, Wu Talk. <laughs> <laughs> We I thought it'd be it. funny to switch our roles around, and uh, we realized that Peter kind of has a cooler version of Jeremy's haircut, and uh, okay. Vit and Bachi actually do look alike if you look at them really closely. Right. And, uh, and, then, uh, and Nina and me... Yeah, just, you know. Yeah, we just have the same just, voice apparently. Yeah, so, we yeah. just sound like uh, they're, they're, they're always just screaming. Same pitch. Same pitch. Yeah, same pitch you know. Cushy do you? Tell them what just you were wild. gonna say before though. Oh, no, How they should have yeah. had a fourth person. Oh yeah, yeah. A big buff guy to be me. Yeah. <laughs> that's <laughs> they had like a fourth person you know, like is, just jacked. Like, 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 like it would have been Esther and him would have switched. Yeah, you yeah. can't say Hey, I'm, I'm switching with Nina, so let's uh, let's calm Wait, down. Wait, so none of you guys are from L.A. What, what brings you out here? No. We're well, here for our good friend Wu Talks, yes, Super Bonsai. Yeah. For my birthday. Launch. Yes, for, <laughs> for my birthday. We yeah. are his test subjects for this weekend, right, so right. we got completely plastered um, mm -hmm. as party mm -hmm. oh, using yeah. his products. And yes. then the next morning, we woke up early and went to the beach. Whoa. Right. I saw Nina use oh, her body so to the test. She was dead, throwing up everywhere. <laughs> And had Damn. to get carried, and then and then died, and then woke up with no hangover. Was Nina actually that drunk? Nina yes, was man. Nina was kind of gone. She kind of saw. Yeah, yeah, we gotta we gotta yeah, switch yeah. we gotta switch our identities back so I'm, that people I'm, are. I'm, gonna, I'm confused. Yeah, so <laughs> let's re let's actually introduce them now. So this is Nina Lynn. Oh, Nina, what's yeah, up? Introduce so, yourselves. Yeah, yeah. Oh, my name is Nina. You know, the best. Thank you. From East Coast, West Coast sucks. Where where in East Coast? New Jersey. New York. New York, baby, New York. Mr. Peter, Peter Bowie. Where from, are you from? From Texas. Hey, also make sure your mic is pointed right at you and you got to put your, like, almost kiss. No, no, don't, don't put your lips on it. But just close. You pointed at the middle. Yeah, yeah, yeah pointed at the middle. Yeah, there you go. You could tighten it, this, the little knobs on the side. Yeah. To make mm. sure it doesn't, like, keep turning upwards. All right, we're good. There Miss, you go. Mr. Botch. My name is Bachi, Texas. Uh, and uh, what, what flavor of Asian are all you guys? Nah. I'm Vietnamese. Vietnamese. Chinese, you know, <laughs> Xi Jinping. So we. I <laughs> switched when she said that. I don't know what they talk hey, about. We love Xi Jinping. My back started hurting. It's probably from my gasoline from earlier. That's why. Why? <laughs> we're pro. No, we're not. Um, yeah. So we've got a couple topics. One of them being the the underlying race war between Vietnamese and Koreans. Wait yeah, a second. I'm just gonna right. skip over the fact that today is his birthday. Oh yes. Yeah. 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 Today, 
today is my real birthday. Wow. Thank you, thank you. Everybody uh, kiss him. Just, just on the lips. Okay. Right. You can send me a kiss. You can blow me. If a you kiss. guys, if you guys I'm want three business days. <laughs> <laughs> if you guys want to support Wu Talk, you yes. can yeah, hit we'll the drink subscribe up some button for that. Um, hey, what's the yeah. best way they could? Su- what's the best way they could subscribe? Fruit, orange, the guava? best way they could subscribe. Mm-hmm. So okay, so you? obviously supporting the products always supports the no show, aftertaste? but also the fourth wall, no the, our exclusive content platform under the influence show. Subscribing to that would make me very happy on my birthday. But it's busting. I have no. It's, it's good. so weird. Yeah. It's like, it's like almost as, as if it's like an authentic Asian flavor. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> 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 almost oh, works no. as well as the bonsai that I had that morning. <laughs> mm-hmm. Crazy. I can't drink because I got sick from going to Wutok's party. Yeah. That party was wild. The party was crazy. Yeah, what did you guys think of the party? The party was wild. Was it was uh, the tacos, amazing. Mm. Yeah, you were like, "Oh, the beans are so bomb." <laughs> Do you remember that? I ate so much of those beans. You don't understand. I was probably farting. It was very my ass classy, low key. That was classy. It felt like it was very classy. Nice. Hey, you guys can grab the mic Wait, and pick it up too. What if you part don't. of the? Yeah, yeah. What part of it was classy? Was classy. Huh? Because it was catered. Yeah, but not only that, like compared to like Texas, like uh, mm. oh, we get a little bit more ratchet. They yeah, get they, ratchet. Yeah, yeah, yeah they. So yeah, that wasn't there. ratchet for y'all? That wasn't nah, ratchet for y'all? No. It kind of felt like a networking event. Yeah. 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 But it was fun, though. It, it was, was fun. Very it was like fun. Drunk networking event. Yeah. They yeah. just dissed you, Loki. Yeah, they said, really? I don't know how to throw a party. It's a business. Really? It's, it's, it's nice. That's nice. crazy. <laughs> no, like, yeah, even and there, there was so much puke at the end of that party. Like, um, I was like looking around there and there was puke on everything. Yeah. <laughs> hey, you puked? Oh, no, it definitely was not this Nina. It was another Nina. Did you? You puked? No, no, it's clean. Oh. I got puked on. I don't like that. Oh, it's fine. Fine. I wouldn't know. I wouldn't know why. Oh, I'm about to gag. I don't know. don't be doing that uh, shit out here. That's crazy. Yeah. I, you, you know what I'm saying? It's just, you know it's your first time in LA, Bobby? My stomach. Yeah, first time in Cali. Oh. So you're, you're, you live where? In Houston, Texas. What's the difference, right? So from what you can tell, what's the difference so um, far in the partying? <clears throat> partying scene? Yeah. It gets you, a little you more. You've been to ghetto. the club and shit, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. It's, uh, I haven't really been in the clubs, but like, um, the clubs here Well we went to Lock and Key And it was like All cramped and stuff Yeah uh, In Houston Everything is sectioned off mm-hmm. Yeah cause uh, we don't Have enough land Yeah Yeah. <laughs> you, guys, you guys took it no. You guys have to Yeah everything is huge But one thing I like About Cali is like They will throw ass Like Houston They, they want to be like Bougie so bad Like they no. don't want To throw ass Really Yeah some, I heard there's a lot like Of gold right? diggers in Texas no? Yeah Yeah, yeah I heard Hey the one that. time We went with y'all To fucking heart well, one they one of the ask. girls, the first thing she said was like, can you guys order a bottle of spades? And I was like, nah, what the f***? That's not how she said it. She's like, the only thing I drink is Ace of Spades. Yeah, and then really? just stare. Wow. And I'm like, I drink okay, only drink go water. over there. <laughs> the f- like, <laughs> Looks like you're not drinking tonight. Yeah, I, was like, I, I don't <laughs> even home. know who you are. <laughs> yeah. Wait, Nina, I have a question. Is it true that people in New York drink the tap water because it's safe? Oh, it's hella good. We got the best tap water. Right? I told you guys. I told you guys. And you guys said it was disgusting. We got the cleanest tap water. I didn't say say it was disgusting. No, no. It is disgusting. Forget about the actual water. Think about the pipes it's going through to get to you. You think they're cleaning out the pipes? Right, right. But also think about the process it goes through, right? It's a and lie. they fill it's it with elite. chemicals. Explain, so explain, explain the process. Think about Nina. the dirt of New York con- compared to like any other state. Like we just like, got the best dirt, best quality dirt, best quality water, best quality pipes, everything best quality. <laughs> they still do what it is. New York has the, the best. First time I went to New York, I saw dirt. Yeah. yeah, exactly. Hey, hey, she says every syllable of quality. Hey, hey, <laughs> quality. <laughs> quality. Hey, question. Who the fuck is that? I just question though. Have you ever tested the water? Are you just trusting some website, the New York Water Company? No, no I drink it. it. I, never I am a product of it. I'm a product of that shit. Hey. That's the perfect example as, as to why <laughs> you don't drink the, the what tap. What does that mean? <laughs> I don't know. Jeremy, don't try that no, shit Nina, I agree. Here. I drank the tap water. It was good. Did Thank she just you, order more, more protein? Surprisingly good. Oh, I'm not going to lie, Esther. If you drank the tap water right now, it'll Is it kill milk? Your back. I promise you, it will cure your back. Oh, it's just more cookies? What the okay. fuck? What? Right, right, they like or skimmed you on cookies? Wow. It's know. a cookie subscription? No, I don't know. But hey, uh, I mean, thank, shout out my management. Shout out Byron, Amanda, Kaylee, all y'all. Wow. Thank you. Wow, they sent them cookies. They, they bought me cookies. And look at the the Uber delivery person's here. Come Even on, don't be shy. Cookies. Don't be shy. Yeah. Wow, uh, thank, thank you, you. Hey, Mr. Wow. Uber Delivery. Yeah. Yeah. That's my wow. wife. Thank you. Hey, by That's the way, super weird you took your shoes off and you came into the house, but... That's my wife that's, right there. That's Danny. She'll be on the next episode. <laughs> oh, yeah, she will. Um, what Same. kind of cookie y'all want? Who likes peanut butter Chocolate cookies? chip. Oh, that is disgusting. Oh, I do like peanut butter. Snickerdoodle? But chocolate chip. Just got to go to the classic chocolate chip. There's only three chocolate chips. <laughs> split them. Yeah. Everyone can share uh, them. Yeah, we can Open split them. I'm going to eat the last one. Can I also get one. an oatmeal raisin? There you go. Cookies for you? Mm. Snickerdoodle? There is none, but this chocolate decadence looks like you'd like it. Okay. 
It's what about, like, what do you it just want? just looks like he liked Nina? that. I prefer nectar. So no wow, cookie for you? let's go. Oh, with the side of bonsai. I'm so yeah. <laughs> hey, she's the chasing best. the bonsai. She's taking like nine pills a night. Yeah. <laughs> the, the, the best guest we've had. Dude, for real. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, appreciate it. I'm going talk. Hey, P- <laughs> do you want a cookie or no? Oh, I'm chilling. Thank you. What about, what do you want? Well, yeah, we'll I'll, take a, I'll take another one. Here, you can have that one. Oh, chocolate decadence. Okay. Oh, there's cinnamon brulee too. Oh, wants that. I want that one. Well, actually, give me one of the peanut butter. Sw- swap me for the peanut butter. We bring them. Oh, she wants that. Uh, give me the chocolate. No, I want All right. Both. Okay. Now it's turning into a mukbang. Let's get back on topic. Yeah. What was? What were we just talking about? Your Cali. party. New York. Oh, you know, partying between Houston. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah that. Oh. So please explain to the people out there that don't understand what is throwing ass. Oh man! Throwing off. Wait, 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 wait! Demonstrate for us, please. Oh yeah, go ahead. Nina, can you do that for us? Oh, please? I ain't got none, unfortunately. I'm Chinese. Wait, 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 wait! <laughs> Funny story from Lock and Key. There was some dude fucking throwing it back on Nina. Like it was like le- legit reverse, like tor- like it was crazy. And oh, Bachi was standing there. She had him bent over, like straight guy too. I know him. And then huh? <laughs> Bachi was standing there. <laughs> Just these are his eyes, like. <laughs> and, the, and, the, and then he comes over to Eddie and he goes oh so this is how LA get down and he's like when you go start doing that Eddie <laughs> nah I was like Eddie, damn you- like LA y'all like throwing ass like guys like guys like throwing ass I mean I wouldn't say that. I, don't I think know guys and girls they both thing. like to throw ass no but yeah. in a way Nina like shoved his shoved his head down oh my god <laughs> I don't think he really had a choice like yeah. I don't know Nina, that's how are you New into York that do you prefer down. your men to throw ass on you Yes, actually, yes. I do like a juicy fat ass. You know, that is that is something I strive for. You feel me? Like, no, that's you. Grass, that's all you gang. Grip. That's all you gang. All right. Nah, yeah. you already lost the weight. You oh, ain't got no booty cheeks man. anymore, Peter. <laughs> you done. You out of the league, bro. My but God. listen, a nice grab is just like you know, in the morning, just down. My life is round. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. That man stole you know my whole damn <laughs> Why does he look the dude so that was throwing ass, he stole she stole my hoe. my ass in the No, morning. I know. Yeah, you lost your girl to a guy that was throwing ass. First of all, when you be walking with that jaddy, it's just different. When it's like, it moves. Diff- yeah, let me stop talking about ass right here, real quick. <laughs> it moves different. I thought I thought that Houston would would get down more than LA. I feel like LA everybody so has like an image to hold. You know, no, 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 I no, no, no. So they too. like to get ratchet in LA. Mm. Yeah, mm. they get a lot more I ratchet. Think it's just the, the places that we go. Mm. I mean, dude, we went to that Vietnamese restaurant. That shit was crazy. Yeah, they had a DJ. With lasers, and then it was just like in fifty year old. Yeah, they had like fifty year old fam, like just men, like smoking like a, and drinking. Like just, spot. It was like young yeah. young people on one side, and then just the OGs on the other side, and everyone was getting turnt, and they were bringing out full spreads of food. That was crazy. No, right. I love Houston, honestly. Yeah, yeah. There's so many Vietnamese. There. Yeah, but that was not a. That was more of a. Ra- I can understand why you're like that's Houston's ratchet. That party. Okay, was, I was. Mm. I will be down there soon. Okay, wait. We're talking about all this Asian shit. Tell them about that TikTok. Oh, so you mm. guys saw that TikTok uh, where that guy, he basically said, what did he say? Let me pull up the TikTok. Basically, there's a very viral TikTok where the where the subtitles is, I hate all Asian friend groups. He has to be yes. be it. And there's it no basically way. was, what is an Asian guy saying it? Mm. And it's gone super viral. And the point of it is, when a friend group is all Asian, you know how sometimes they don't fuck with people who are non-Asian. Yeah. You bring your non-Asian yeah. friends, yeah. they feel hella excluded right so that's the debate right it's that like people are arguing like well there's a reason why people asians like to just hang out with asians if they're defending it and then if um yeah okay so the word for word is i don't know what it is but i genuinely do not like asian friend groups read the caption because most of y'all just like y'all's parents toxic gossipers and rude damn Damn. Damn. can i tell you the first thing that i thought of though yeah i thought of church so, like, uh, my, my dad's a pastor. When I went to church, there's the Korean congregation, which, you know, they only speak Korean. And then yeah, there was the English side that. where you speak English. And the Korean <clears throat> side at the church I went to was toxic as hell. Like, straight up went through the time. My dad was the English pastor. But through the time that I was there, they went through three Korean pastors because the whole congregation would, like, gossip and, like, drama. basically kick them out. It was, it was crazy. It was, like, a repeated thing. So when I read this, I was like... Yeah, I kind of see. Like when he said, "Like y- y'all are like your parents, like toxic gossipers." Y'all I don't think like, that's oh. an Asian thing, though. Like y'all don't definitely think not a white Chinese people. thing. I also thought that too. You know? I think it's I think it's every race. I think it's every race you can find it. But right. specifically, I was like, it is kind of common. In I, I saw it in different versions of it. What were you gonna? What do you What do you think about that? 
Well, I was just thinking, like, I feel like every race got, like, the mean ants or, like, the people that just talk a little bit too much. Mm-hmm. I think Asian do a little more, though. Why? Why do why you think that? I actually Because what else do they have to do? <laughs> I mean, I just think that there's a lot the of, aunties like, and uncles. standards. There's a lot of standards set in place that they have to, like, live up to. Mm-hmm. For Asians? Yeah. Especially on the kids and, like, the younger They generation. got a chip on their shoulder. Because, like, to America. of, like, immigrants. And then, like, they never yeah. went through the whole school system, but they want you to do it instead. So, it's mm-hmm. a lot of that comparison thing. Yep. It's just always trying to win and flex. It's like a flexing culture. That's it. So well, <clears throat> Very true. But I think, but I kind of agree with him. I think every race. <clears throat> I agree with. Every race does it. The, I think, um. Asian specific, like Nina said, there's higher standards. Like, Asia, yeah. there's a reason why Asians are winning they're as very, shit like, in, in America. They're very aggressive. They don't do it. Yeah, and they're not, and they're not very in your face about it. But it, like, what you said is funny because it was like the English congregation, right, at a Korean church, and then the Korean side is the toxic one. Because an example of church, a lot of people that immigrate to America need a need a spot to meet up with their peoples, mm-hmm. and it's always church. So people that are going are not very like they're not at church to go to church. They're at church for to be social because it's the only place to meet other Koreans. So at the Korean congregation, that's what happens. Like people are not really there for spiritual reasons. It's a, it's a social club, I didn't and know that's that. when you create drama because you're you're literally there just to fucking talk, talk shit, shit and gossip and, and just eat. be around your people. Yeah, right. And Koreans specifically are a very dramatic people, to be honest oh, with you. Oh, yeah. yeah, I've seen K-dramas. Yeah. <laughs> it's not all like that. They don't nah, have they C-drama. They slow-mo like one scene for like five minutes. Yeah, I'm like, yeah. I don't understand. Koreans love to be dramatic. <laughs> In different angles. Yes. <laughs> I'm like, why? Same scene. It's the hand-holding scene. It's like legit like... Uh, take, like takes, over here? Yeah, it takes See, four this episodes. One, this one, this one, this one, I'm like, oh, no. <laughs> Hey, do they not have C-dramas or V-dramas? Oh, they, they do have They have hella C-dramas. 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 It's funny. It's funny. You guys don't like, have Vietnamese dramas? Vietnamese. We were always thinking about like doing videos like that, but they they did that, that like Kailun and stuff like. Yeah. yeah. Chinese dramas are like hella dramatic. Too. Uh, like, why do you think that Asians in general? Why do you think that? <clears throat> it's a lot of like the CEO meets like a poor girl. That's all of it. And age. they have to save her type bullshit. Hey, it's the but same the poor shit girl has a new fit on every day. She got a new like yeah. designer fit on daily, even though she lives in like the hood. And it's just crazy. Wow. Go no see. You know hey, why? Why haven't C dramas caught on? Like you know, now yeah. Netflix has so much. Korean, Korean dramas. Drama, Why do you yeah. think C dramas have like crossed over into America? Well, I just think that it's just too good. You know, when it's too good, you know, people want to hate on it, and it is what it is. You know, what I'm saying it will we'll catch on soon, though. You know, I what feel I'm like saying? if they yeah, star Nina Lin, do you like, watch them? oh, C dramas. Yeah. They, okay, that's one thing about C dramas. They have like seventy episodes <clears throat> for one season. Like, like it's crazy. It's like in each episode is in a full hour. It's not even like twenty minutes. Damn. That's the only thing I can't commit to that. That's too long. That's Wait, like Love Island. Full hour? Season of Love Island. Like a one full hour. Yeah. Korean and Korean dramas is like a uh, sixteen episode and then it's like an hour. Yeah. Which is which is an easy no, watch. It's seventy episodes. Like I'm not watching seventy episodes. <laughs> and I'm the type when I watch You shows, watch anime? Oh hell no. No? Mm-mm. What? <laughs> no. What about you? What about you two? I gotta I see love where your Asian anime. cards are at while we're talking I about these Family things. Guy. <laughs> That's That's not. Enough. What okay, what what other you watch other American cartoons or? Oh, Tom and Jerry, SpongeBob. Wait, like as of today? Oh no, not today. I'm just family guy for now. Yeah, I was gonna say me too. Wait, yeah, she, she's catching up on SpongeBob. Yeah. She's like, I'm on uh, season American four. American Dad, you know what I'm saying? That's pretty good. And you don't watch anime either, Peter? Mm. Mm. Peter doesn't really culture, man. Watch. I don't watch anything. Yeah, yeah. yeah he yeah, just work out. He we're like Bolo Young. We don't have yeah, to watch really cartoons. Watch <laughs> I also just watch true crime. True crime? Like murder, mm. true crime. Like documentaries? Oh yeah, I love that shit. Like dinosaurs, same, same. Egyptians, like. Shit really? like that. Oh yeah. yeah. National Geographic stuff. Hey, there's a pattern here. Women that could beat you up love dinosaurs. <laughs> huh. And, so, and es- violence. Okay. Yeah, Esther loves dinosaurs. I, and serial I, I killers. I do like dinosaurs. <laughs> I don't love serial killers. I like the crime they're, stuff. They're like, funny though. Actually, no, they're not funny, but they're like interesting. <laughs> it's interesting to watch, it's interesting, yeah. yeah. It's like, damn, what is in the mind of these the weirdos? Oh, but going yeah, back yeah. to the... Yeah. Esther, your sister. Bro, we thought that was you like 10 times. Bro, the party. at the party, every time she walked by, I was like, damn, she look like Esther, Esther Peter. She doesn't have a sister. Jessica. Oh, Jessica. Jessica. That's not your sister? No, no, no. That's no, not no, your I sister? Call, no, no, no. I call her my sister Y'all because like everyone twins. tells... See, trolling everybody. Yeah, everyone tells us that we look like... Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, no, my God. We just decided to go along with it. We just decided to go along with it. Is she Korean, too? or She's Korean, yeah. I thought she was Chinese. But she's like she's like the dark... She People call her like the mocha Esther, and then they call me the... The vanilla? <laughs> the vanilla. The vanilla. Oh. oh. <laughs> they call her the vanilla gorilla. Jessica. Got her ass. Oh, hey, go <laughs> man. Why y'all gotta grease her like that? Yeah, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Would you rather have the world dominated by aliens or dominated by AI? 
Hey, this does not reflect hey, whoa, whoa, our show. Just by relax. Way. This they is like just this a question. This was a Jeremy segment. It's okay. already dominated by aliens and AI. Mm-hmm. Explain. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> no. I actually didn't hear Peter's uh, accent until right now. His Texas oh, accent. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. I think Peter's got the coolest accent. I love to hear yeah. Peter talk. Right, right. It's like a little. It's like a southern, and then a little hit, hit, a little hit. Yeah. 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 He, so, he sounds like the he would E-haw. call your girlfriend's his girlfriend's E-haw. dad, sir. No, he does. He's always like, "Yes, ma'am. Thank yeah. you, sir." Yeah. I, I hear. That, I feel like that's a very Texas thing, though. Like I say, "Yes, ma'am." Me too. I went to New York and I met her friends, and I was just like, "Yes, ma'am." There. Damn. Yeah. <laughs> the fuck? Like, yeah. Yeah. Like, yeah, yeah. We'd be like, we'd be like, yo, what's up? Or like, yo, they call hey. each other bitch as default. Oh, what's up, bitch? Yeah. 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 yeah same thing when I went out in Texas. Everyone's like, bitch. <laughs> bitch. I'm like, yeah. I didn't mean it like that. Like, it's not like that. Well, I guess all in Texas is really similar too. We say yes, ma'am, yeah. yes, sir. Like, we taught that. Like Southern hospitality. The South, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah. so sweet. I like that. I know. I, wish, I like the I South. I wish they would do it here. Mm-hmm. But don't be fooled. Though. Y'all don't do that. Like, how do y'all? What are people in LA talk? How do they talk? This how y'all greet each other. I'd be like. What do you do? Oh, oh my! Y'all don't give a fuck about names. Fuck that! Yeah. What are you doing? What are you doing? Why are you doing? Why are you doing? How, can, how can I use you? Yeah. Wait, yeah. Might as well just ask. What's your uh, What's your What's your social media account? account? What's your, yeah. What's your, what's account, your social right? security? Wait, you know they what don't do that in Texas. So what do you ask, ask them? No. What's your first name? Always, what's your name? What's your name? How you doing? How's your day? Wait, wait, wait. We ask people. How's your day? Yes. Who gives a fuck? You actually care about their day? Yes, I do. Yeah, they do. Yeah, they do. Yeah. The, the bro, the gas station worker asked me that shit, and then he tried to genuinely make my day better. I was like, yeah. "Wow, Aww, man, you want to hang out later? Like, what you doing later?" I just like, feel like they have so much time. My down own there. friends in LA don't ask me that shit. <laughs> like, and also, name is like very important to a person. This I don't think yeah. it's like. Uh, I can't even remember the, names, so I don't bother to ask. I don't either. But like, <laughs> like let's say at the grocery store, right? Like the clerk, you, I just look at the name type, be like, "Thank you." Jake. Exactly. They'll be like, wow. You know what I mean? Like, that shit goes a long way in yeah. just building relationships yeah. everywhere. Yeah. yeah. When I have, when I used to work in service at my name tag, I'm like, you just read my name tag. You don't know my <laughs> well, name. At least they, at least they name. fucking yeah. tried. You don't be an asshole. Well, yeah, rather, you don't give a shit. What would you rather them call you? Just thank you. Excuse you know me, help. Hey, bus you know boy. Excuse yeah. me, the hey, help. Boy. I don't care. I never care. Bitch, come here. Clean my food. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I like. <laughs> Degrade me. The the kink. Kink. Oh, he, oh, yeah, the oh, great no. king. Oh, I'm kidding. Hey, yeah, does I mean, that mean we are that toxic Asian friend group? What do you mean? Mm. You, got, you have like non Asian no friends? Uh, I mean, before this social media thing, I wouldn't say I was really like hanging out with like an Asian friend yeah. group. Really? But is it because, is it by choice or just because of the environment? You know what I'm saying? Like some people will avidly go out their way yeah. to only hang out with Asians, whereas some people are just like, I only grew up around Asians. Oh, oh no! I wish. No, I think they're almost they're they're almost they're like parallel. But I like for me, I had no Asian friends until social media stuff. Like oh. until I was like twenty two, two twenty no twenty four is when like I started hanging out with Asian people again. But and you and that's then, why and that's why you went by John. No, I started going my Wu Talk at like. Oh, weren't you like a frat boy? Yeah, yeah. He said, "Hey, everybody!" He's like, "Hey, everybody!" It's John. Nobody never sounded like that. Who wants the shotgun? It shit makes sense. Oh, damn! That's unfortunate. With no Asian people, there was no Asian frats. Yeah, Mm -hmm. there was no Asian people. Period. Me too, but I was the other side. What was it? Just every, almost every environment I grew up in was very not Asian. What was it then? What do you mean? White. Yeah, yeah, yeah. White, Hispanic. Yeah. Oh, that explains it. Mm-hmm. That was the same for me too. Yeah. Right. Well, I started hanging out with Wait. Asian people in high school, and then um, I mean, LA, like K Town, everyone's Korean, right? Yeah. And then, yeah, it's just also I hang out with Asians because the food. Like there are times. <laughs> no, no, I'm not gonna lie. Like there are times when like I like I I meet other people and then they're i'm just like let's go eat hot pot they'll be like what's hot pot yeah and then they're like that sounds weird and and food is huge for me i want to eat with people that love the same type of food as me and then sometimes it got a little hard um to find Damn. people that like you the gotta, same shit. Like, like if I was off. eating some weird weird shit like chicken feed, they'd be like, what is that? I don't even want to try it. They think it's like disgusting. You know? Her, her hey. white friends are like, Esther, you haven't touched your mayonnaise. Your <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. This What's is wrong, Esther? <laughs> hey, how's your uh, Esther? What's but wrong? about that video, that the whole... F- <laughs> So many people have stitched it. Each video what's is getting the, What's the more popular it's side of it? Or what? The, no, yeah. it's it's kind of split, but a lot of people are saying, yeah, either yeah. I wasn't accepted into that yes. toxic Asian friend group because I was half Asian, or I've Aww. seen versions saying, yeah, I used to be a part of one, and it was disgu- and I regret that shit. Uh, and but, like, but I agree with that because it was, I would bring, like, 
Me going to an all white event, I will, I'll give this to white people. They're way friendlier to other races. They may have okay. microaggressions, right? But like oh, yeah. white places, white bars are the only place you'll still see a, a good amount of other races in the spot. You go to an Asian club, like <laughs> there is nobody Asian. else. You know what I'm saying? You talking about Den Social? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, it's done. And then I'll bring my non-Asian friends because it's like, yo, let's go to this place. Like my yeah. other friends are there. Like it just makes sense. And then they've like, they're like, oh, I feel a little uncomfortable. Like yeah, people brought, treat them differently. Uh, like, it's funny because- and, and Asians are one of the few that do that in my opinion like I've gone okay. to other clubs like yes Jeremy question alert question alert mm -hmm. do you think that's because a lot of times too Asians were also pushed out of one groups? million percent uh, so it's like now you're like I feel cool because what I noticed is some of my really Asian friends because I was on both sides you know when they would go out to the white clubs, or, you know, they're not getting no attention from girls, things like that. So in Asian clubs, it's like, yo, this is my domain. It's also why the Asian frats in, in my college only partied with the other Asian. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. No, I agree. I don't think it's for no reason, but I think that if you want a problem to disappear, you can't just start doing it yourself. You know what I mean? You guys, I noticed this about like Korean fobs though. Yeah. Like I wouldn't say like American Korean. I haven't experienced that. But then with like Korean Koreans, like straight from Korea, they're very exclusive. What and they interest? even like I'm, I'm yeah. Korean as well, but then they treat you differently. I think it's like a supportive system though mm -hmm. for them. More like yeah. that. It's like, oh, people that think the same, yeah. been in the same situation. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just like a defense mechanism mm -hmm. most of yeah. the time. Because I think growing up, if you were in a place with less Asians, you do get pushed out of other friend groups. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So when you do find it, you hold on to it, right? Mm -hmm. So it's, it's a little bit different. So that's why I think now there's such a big emphasis on like big Asian populated areas. Because mm -hmm. like before, we we're so looked down upon. I think like just 10 years ago, it was like. Literally. I can see it in New I've York City. Had too. That problem. What? A, I never thought about that. Wait, where did you you grow up? Where? Bachi? Arkansas. <laughs> what what town in or city in Arkansas? Fort Smith, Arkansas. And you were what part of New York? Lower East Side. Lower East Side. Yeah. That's like born and raised. Born and raised. So I, oh, there's not a lot of Asians around. Uh, Chinatown's around the corner. Uh huh. But like where I went to school for like <coughs> most of my uh, middle school, high school, whatever, I was usually only the only Asian. Mm -hmm. So like it was a lot. I mean, kids are kids, right? They're gonna bully you. They're gonna say Regardless, shit about like yeah. oh chink this and that like whatever. Like Damn. you can't just sit there and take it. So it was a lot of like oh, yeah. physical fighting, this and that. You, had to, you, you, had was, you was fighting? Like fist fights? Yeah, I was like... You I can't was, tell? That fighting. voice doesn't come from being a ballerina. Oh, shit. <laughs> I, I was a ballerina from kindergarten. Actually? Right? Yes. Dude. You're for lying. Like two years. Hey, hit a hit. What is that thing? Hit one right a now. A I, I, can't, a pirou, I, can't, I can't do it. I, uh, fine. I could. Oh, She's oh actually? Oh, shit. Oh. Hey, wait, wait. wait. Oh. Really okay. Get this on camera. Get this on camera. It's just like ankle shit. Wait, wait, wait. Do we have the... Maybe you film it on your... Hey man, oh, this is gonna make me feel some type right, of way. Right, right, right. oh, yeah. Did she hit this hole? Like, oh, she hit this hole? Oh, okay, I got you it. Yeah. Probably. Hey, if you know, I will. Just this. That's all it is? That's all you remember? Oh, she's a liar. Hey, get her out of here. What's this? What's this? I thought she was gonna twirl. I thought she was gonna yeah, twirl. Yeah, you went to a ballet school in the Bronx. Yeah, right, boy? Okay. Hit that spin and then start boxing. Guys, it was pre K. It was fucking pre K. Okay, let me go. Nina, you ever do some lame shit like that again? Bro, and what I'm breaking you up do? with you. I'm breaking and what up you with you. All that is never together, so it don't Wait, matter. Question: Peter and Bachi, have you guys ever experienced racism in Texas or Arkansas or Kansas? Arkansas. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Uh, I know it's Arkansas. <laughs> they never like said it verbally, but like I, I felt that vibe though. Mm. But like I was, I've always really? been like I always, always kind of just fit it in. You know really? I, mean? yeah. Yeah. I don't I, think I ever got bullied, but I remember there was like times where, where like I had moments where. Uh, there was racism, but there's like more like there's advantages to being Asian. Really? Like reverse, really? Like this one time. Wait, wait. You grew up in an Asian area. Nah, I grew no. up. What you mean? Like what area did you grow up in? In Texas? Yeah. Like Arlington. It was like the suburbs. Dallas. Is that outside of Dallas, right? Mm -hmm. And there's, is that very Vietnamese or no? Um, in the hood? No, nah, I mean, I would say there was like Vietnamese people everywhere. Mm. Um, I just grew up around my family a lot. Mm -hmm. And then we worked mm -hmm. like in the heart of like Fort Worth in this neighborhood called Eastwood. Y'all ever seen like, I don't know if y'all seen this. Uh, is it Menace to Society? Or like oh. The movie, yeah. Where like they shot up like the Asian people in the liquor store. Is that yeah. Menace to Society? Hurry up and buy. Bro, like, we were like that Asian family in the hood. You know mm. what I mean? Like just working just the convenience working. store. So it's not like we were in the community. We were just a part of it in a different way. Yeah. Right. Mm. So I, I remember there was like, like moments where I would experience like reverse racism. So like, I'm not going to get into too many details, but we'd just be doing shit we weren't supposed to be doing, me and my friends, right? And this one time, the police started running after us. 
and everybody we we at the top story of like an apartment complex everybody starts jumping off i put my leg over all right my friends a little bit more athletic so i'm looking at them falling on the grass i fuck this shit like i just go to jail it's okay i put my leg back over and i start jogging towards the police oh i started jogging towards the police and they stopped me they're like excuse me i'm like yes sir they did you see any black kids no. run this way? Oh, officer, they they went that way. Went to the car. We all met up at the car. We left. Holy! So that's fuck, why I was like, man. okay, like, and they, and they was definitely looking for y'all. Not definitely. Oh my looking god! For us. Like, you definitely. was wiping sweat and shit. I was what? acting like I was jogging. I put headphones in. I hit a light jog. Wow! Yeah. Damn! They're like, why are you I running like, away? And you're like, just off, just out for a jog, officer. Yeah. <laughs> then full I, speed. Then I at the yeah, with the black kids over there. <laughs> with, je- with jeans on? Over there. <laughs> yeah. That's pretty good. That's, that's crazy. wild. Yeah. That's lit. What about you, Mr. Vietnam? In, o- in Ohio, right? Like in Iowa? Yeah. Iowa. Because um, you grew up around, you're the opposite. You didn't grow around Asians. No, not at all. Yeah. The only Asian friends I had was like family friends, and I saw them once every two weeks when the families converged. Uh, I went to a pretty white school, and all the white people had that like, they they were like the the popular friend group so like Same. other than them you couldn't really get in so i mostly just hung around like black people we yeah but them. then Same. when then is it cuz of social media too you started like when did you start hanging out with asian people you guys like, are the first asian friends i've really had in my life <laughs> really oh. yeah yeah. That is crazy. What and then the even hell? then, you guys are Korean. So uh, I've told Peter, when I went to Houston, I met his mom and shit. That was the first time, like, I, people talk about how, like, the, the the feeling they get when they, they're around their own people and, like, their community. I never had that feeling until I went to Texas. Mm. So Aww. that's when I really, and that's that was. Great. My great. mom fucking loves Viet, bro. Yeah. Like, that was, like, that was literally, like, two months ago. So. Yeah. 20 at 24 I, I experienced that it's a wild experience wait so Vit, do you hate do you hate the asian like group as well because you know how yeah mostly yeah, okay. because like like you guys were talking about it was we i saw him. most of them at church mm. and it was mostly like social events and then there was just mad gossip mm. yep. uh, another big reason why i started hating going to church um and then i would just hear the families talk and it was like the the motherfucking families that didn't have enough money were talked down upon the ones that had, yeah, like issues at home were gossiped about. It was just a whole bunch of mm-hmm. shit. So a lot of outside noise. Yeah, mm-hmm. it's like hypocrisy too. And honestly, right. since 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 I was young, it was just like I've always like the black community and like kind of like Mexican. I grew up with a few Mexican people too. They uh they've always just accepted me. So see, I have this picture where. My old friend group is literally just full of black people. I'm the only Asian one. <laughs> There's eight black dudes and me in the picture. I posted it one time. I got hella DMs. They're like, are you photoshopped in this? <laughs> what? <laughs> are you photoshopped? I thought I picked did you. Up. Did you photoshop yourself in this? I'm like, oh bro. My God. I, had, I had like all kind of race friends growing up. And I yeah. just remember one time, this girl in my class, I won't say her name, in seventh grade, she was like, your eyes are tiny. And I and she was I mean, like, they are. What? She's not lying. No, I'm just gonna. <laughs> and she was like, "Can you actually see?" And I was like, <laughs> and I was like, and I was like, I was like, nah, I actually can't. I was like, I went like this, and I said, "You see that? That's all I could see. That's why when you see me in class moving my head up and down, it's because I can't see the whole board." She was like, "No shit." I was like, "I'm serious." Not serious. Yeah, I was like, that probably tripped think? her out. Yeah. Wide screen. Yeah. yeah. Oh, slim, also. Slim screen. I, I feel like I've said this before, but I don't know if I said it on this podcast. In sixth grade, I had this uh, this white kid that I considered like one of my closest friends just because going to school, we'd make jokes and laugh together. <laughs> Literally. And then um, there was one joke where he would call me China Boy. Like that was his nickname for me. Damn. And I never realized how much of a problem was that China. was until I grew yeah. up. Mine was, mine was Centimeter Peter. Because I'm Asian. <laughs> Say it again. Mine was Cin- <laughs> Centimeter <laughs> Peter. <laughs> So, I you that. so Peter. just because I was Asian, they thought, you know what I'm saying? That's just a stereotype. Wait, Dude, centimeter, centimeter's a lot. Centimeter, centimeter <laughs> Peter. Nah, they call me Ling Ling. Oh, your name is Peter, too? Ling no, no, no. My school, so my Bachi, school used Bachi. to be like a, like a prison, the building. Uh-huh. And then there's like four different schools, but all of them are charter schools. So charter schools are like the schools where all the kids who pretty much don't have a future left, <laughs> they go there. So I was like a disappointment, like to the max, right? 
and I'll be the that's why I was the only Asian, but those are like badass kids. Yeah. I don't think they're badass, they're just misunderstood. That's it. Like they just focus on different things. I mean, yeah, they're kids. The yeah, they're probably kids. not their right. fault. It's a continuation school, right? Like if if you yeah. get pregnant, you go to No, 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 no not the, that bad. That's no, oh, really? no, no, no. You know what I mean, right? Yeah. They, they the have kids a that got expelled. Like, if you failed, yeah. you expel you got expelled. That's where I was at. Then you go it's like, yeah, you go to such a wall time. Got it, got it. And um so there was like police in class and shit too. Like our security guards were police. And then when you walk in, there's metal detectors every morning. So you got to put everything on your back yeah, yeah. and all that shit. And then, so now I'm like best friends with a security guard. Cause you know, like they just have a thing against me. It's racially motivated. I think. Cause I got suspended like every week type shit over stupid shit. Like someone threw a milk carton at me. I threw it back. I got suspended. How'd that work? It's cause he was black and I'm Asian. So. Mm-hmm. It doesn't help that the Dean was black too. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. What was the point of this question? I forgot. <laughs> I forgot too. What the fuck? Too. But I do have a new question. No, 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 no. Get no, back no, to the no, original no. point of the question. Why are you trying we to skip over the question? We were talking about, we were talking about nicknames at first. Oh, yeah. Ling Ling. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yo, she, you, so I didn't you pulled up in my own apartment and called me Mulan in my video. <laughs> first, they and called then me the, Mulan for years, so you get the same thing. And, and, was, and, down, the, and then all the comments were like, Mulan is crazy. Asian on Asian violence is crazy. Asian on Asian. Yeah, I'm like, yeah, what? You're calling me Mulan. They call me Niha Kailin, Ling Ling, Mulan. What was it? Hey, you drink hard seltzer. Hey, you want to break the apple? Dude, if you drink hard seltzer, you gotta try mine. You gotta be versatile, freestyle, let it flow. Is that a <laughs> in your car? If you have to, <laughs> you gotta try this. No, I'm not gonna say no. So we have four different types of flavors okay. Asian inspired. This is Asian pear. No weird aftertaste. What do you think? This is Mandarin, right? And we have one new flavor passion fruit. Orange guava pog. That one is good. We can switch that out for you if you want. <laughs> right here. Actually, I think I will switch it. Hooray! Yes! Yes! This one, um, is, really? is this I would have G? Boyish hey, girl. What about stud? <laughs> like a stud. Yeah, 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 yeah. something like that. So stud I used to is look... the funniest word, by the way. My back hurts. Yeah. <laughs> it hurts the no, one. but they used to call me that. <laughs> she had a name, but what she was in the way? beginning of NBA 2K. Uh huh. And she always had like a low. Candace Parker? Down. I don't know, but she, she looked Asian? Like, she looked like a man. <laughs> and I did too. So it, it was the same thing. You don't look like a man though. Hey, you, are you, you s- didn't know me before. So. What was the picture? Oh, you have a Show. call up to that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, okay, so you, you you said you used to look like a man? Yeah. Like when did you glow up, what'd you say? Glow up. Because you clearly do not look like a, a man anymore. Oh no, you gotta see the before. But, That's what I'm um, saying. Like when was that? It's like a transgender thing, you know what I'm saying? Wow, <laughs> you have two lives, yo, this is crazy. So when I used to be a male, um, <laughs> before my surgery, uh, yeah. So <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> did you wait, did you also rock a short haircut or no? No, I always have my hair in a bun. Uh, because like in school, I your size? because in school, if a fight starts, I don't got time to like <laughs> it was for survival, was okay? Like was I was ready. not dressing wow. to impress. What's your record? <laughs> what you mean? Yo, fight record. Fight yeah, what's your street fight, fight record? Uh, I'm not gonna lie, we just be throwing hands and shit. We just, we just. You don't really fight. understand just, who no, won. No, we don't. At the end we don't fight. Like that's what you said when you get your ass. Beat. On some <laughs> no, no, no. I promise you. I promise you. I, I did get my ass beat. Okay, I did, but I did win some and lose some. You feel me? Okay. okay. As a champion, you gotta learn the right way. Exactly. <laughs> you know? Honest well answer. Tell me, you ain't never picked up one of your friends after he got his ass beat. <laughs> just in the car. Like, oh no, I'm gone. Nah. Fight, my, one of my homies, actually, the my, my homies like that's gone now. Back in like eighth grade, he got in a fight. It was like a mad shit before, but he took one punch to the throat and literally like stop the fight. Stop shit. the fight. I'm like, bro, you what can't the like fuck, <laughs> bro? My butt crack was out and everything. Like we'd be on the floor <laughs> bawling because I was fighting this six foot wrestler because he ate my hot Cheetos and oh, like you were fighting a man. Oh yeah, that was yeah, a full on man. Fine. Man, so, oh, I don't really fight girls. girls. I thought you were fighting I never girls. fought a girl. She says she doesn't nah. even fight boys. She's girls. a gentleman. She's I never. Yeah. I'm a gentleman. I never she, fight she, women. She I don't touch women. <laughs> I don't fight females. She don't fight girls. Yeah, yeah, so, so I put my do rag on. You know, I said it's time, game time. So we just go out in the cafeteria, yeah. which is in front of everyone. Yeah. Yeah, butt crack out is not a good look. And there was videos too. Damn, that's I know. crazy. Wait, I that's know. crazy how the guys are fighting you. Yeah. Bro, would you, uh, yeah, that's it. That is crazy. Damn, I really was a man that's back then. Holy crazy. shit. Not that crazy. Sometimes Nina says something, I just. <laughs> <laughs> hey, <laughs> you I, tell her to put the gloves on. I dare you. Bro, I dare you. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> when was like the first time it, when you guys were like growing up where you felt cool being Asian? Uh, Man, I, I, felt, I, I always felt cool being. Asian I didn't want to say it like that, that but you're like, you're probably out like on some, I'm like humble. I want to be humble about it, but like I've always kind of been the cool. Asian. Wow, they they lived wow. very different lives. Wow. No, actually, I yeah. think when I was younger, like I go to church camp and everybody be like, "Oh, he's here." 
Yeah, yeah. Oh, so you were so you were meant for this life always. No. <laughs> oh, by the way, uh, no. in case anybody doesn't know who all three of them are, how would you describe what you do, Nina? Um, ice cream. She rode a garbage truck in okay, New York, that went, yeah. went mega viral, and then uh, and now she also does social media stuff. Yeah. yeah. You haven't posted in a while, though, I feel no, like. No, right? I haven't. So in what are you doing? Whoa. Well, Trapping? No, 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 we keep down the low. We also oh, fed. I hate him. Federal. What are you doing? <laughs> Trapping? Well, I'm just in the I do Is that what the kids the do for money nowadays? Yeah, we just trap. You know what I'm saying? Like, Wait, what do you way. actually been doing? What do you? Well, been? I just do business on the side in New York City. Be- uh, this is before social media too, so mm. I always done that. And then now I just like MC here and there, sometimes at different places, in New- mostly in New York City. But I've traveled with you know Peter and. Danny and Michael, whatever. For You've other done like too. crazy things though, outside of riding a garbage truck, like sneaking into the Met Gala. Oh mm-hmm. yeah, so like, I stuck into the Met Gala once. It was just to test the security. I didn't really care about the Met Gala. I'm be honest with you, because growing up, we always like you know all the kids always rush after school to go watch the Met Gala. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> so for me, I was like, I've seen it a billion times, right? But I was just like, how cool to be that's, if that's I could sick. actually try to get in. So I, I just. I just literally bought a suit that morning. I was on a train. These kids like, yeah, you heard the Met Gala was da 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 I said, oh, shit, like, I'm getting groceries on my bed. I'm going to get me a suit, too. So I get a suit. I go in. You just fly your ass off, basically, right? So after we got in, they didn't even check my bags. The security's ass. So if I really bought a Glock there, I could have shot it the fuck that, up. That's what was crazy oh to God. me is that you got in so easily. Like, this is literally, like, a, the most high-profile people well, in the world. it's because there was a Getty Images camera guy, uh-huh. and he forgot his email confirmation. And I was there with him. I was like, I'm over here scrolling on my phone call. I was like, ah, my, it, it's not in my email. Like, ah, oh, and I fake called. I was like, yo, like, yo, Charles, you upstairs? I have your lens with me, like your camera lens. It's about to start in, like, 10 minutes. I don't know if I can get in. I don't have confidentials. And the lady's in front of me, and this is during COVID time. So she's like, just, you know what? Just show me your COVID form and your ID. And I was like, you sure? To the camera guy, too, because it was going to start in 20 minutes. Mm-hmm. So I caught it just right there. If it wasn't for that other camera guy, yeah, your bitch is not getting Damn. it. Damn. You got so You're lucky. Felon. And that video went stupid You're viral. Like, what, was the, what was the views on that? Like, on YouTube? Ooh, I don't know. It was posted on different places, though. Yeah, it was but like I know everywhere. on TikTok, it was 24. Did the cops, five. like, hit you up and say, yo. Yo, you know what's funny? On the way out, I actually told the cop. I said, hey, like, I'm not going to lie to you. I snuck in this thing, bro. And he goes, you that girl? And I was like, oh, yeah. He's like, yeah, yo, it's cool. It's already over. You- <laughs> what? I said, really? He's like, yeah. I'm like, yeah. And I, I even didn't give a fuck. Bro, they don't the care security about guard that was upstairs for the Met Gala security guard, halfway through, he's like, what do you do? Because one of them, um, one of the people that I interviewed came up to me, asked for a picture. He goes, what do you do? He was like, Mexican or something, Hispanic, Ecuadorian. I don't know, something like that. And then I was like, oh, da, da, da. he's like, can I get a picture? He goes, yeah. And then later on, he helped me sneak into the actual inside. So press, Ooh. so press is not allowed in. Cameraman, all that is not allowed inside. Mm-hmm. But he snuck me in there. And when I was going in there, I saw the baby washing his hands coming out of the bathroom. He was like, this is an awkward ass dude. <laughs> like, he's just like, you don't know whether to smile or not. Like, he was just like, <laughs> no, no, hey, the baby. Hey, hello, Mister the baby. Yeah. Hello, baby. When you were standing on the red carpet, I, I remember the video, but not the details. Were you just like selfieing yourself? Like, how were you recording yourself? Bro, I had no board? camera. Everyone else had cameras. I was using my phone. Yeah, I know. So, were you using your phone just first person? Pointing oh, yeah. It at I people? was literally on Snapchat, like, hey, what's your name? What are you wearing? Can I get a twirl? I and thought you were supposed to be there. I didn't know you snuck in. Oh, I snuck in. No, and you know what? Every single time she does something crazy, people send it to me and they're like, oh, I thought it was you. <laughs> really? Yeah, I was like, okay. okay, I was like, I don't have, first, no, first of all, I don't have the balls to do this shit. When she first went viral because of the trash can video, people were sending this to me and uh, thinking it was me. I see Y'all are like, similar. Y'all are high key similar. And I was, and I was, and I was like, similar. first of all, I don't live Maybe in New York City. Hair. I have black hair. Yeah, 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 yeah. And yeah, like the, the, the pin straight black now. hair. Same yeah. head shape. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Same head. Yeah, yeah. Same menacing <laughs> shoulder <laughs> width. No, no, and then, and then <laughs> I was a lot louder back then too. Oh yeah. Yeah, I calmed down a lot. Oh, I for sure. Up. You were louder like, back then. Huh? Yeah. Even a year ago, from, a year yeah, ago, yeah, I was yeah, crazy. Yeah. Like, yeah. yeah. Who, so you? I got, I got it a lot, and I'd be like, no, that's not me. And then, so I was really yeah. excited to meet you. Well, they thought I died too, so that's a whole wait, different thing. What? Wait, wait, what? Wait, what do you mean? Say it again. Like actually. Wait, what? No, because like I haven't posted in a while. Okay, for sure. And this Asian girl got pushed in a train in New York City. And they made a whole video black and white, like memorial of Nina. I'm like, bro, I'm here. <laughs> like they sending it to me. I'm like, yo, I'm, I'm alive, dog. Like, that's. I think I remember straight. this actually. Yeah, yeah, it went viral. And there was everyone was yeah, me. I'm like, yeah. My best friend actually said, because I, I don't really pay attention. I don't really be on my phone like that. So my best friend actually sent it to me. He was like, why is everyone mourning over you? I said, mourning me. I'm here. Like I just came back from. 
the seaport uh-huh. after a run. Like I'm like, what are you talking hey, about? Hey, you should have pulled a. Have you watched Little Dick? You know Little Dicky's new show, Dave. Uh, no. All right. There's yes. an, there's an episode where he pretends to be dead. <laughs> but it like basically makes his career. You see? <laughs> what? Yeah, because think about like anytime an artist dies, right? Like their streams literally like go 10x, right? Yeah, my follow count did go up from from your fake dying. Yeah. Wait, why does it go up though? I because wish you, I would I fake die. I would know. Because you're not posting anything. If you were actually dead, then you don't post anymore. People why share more when you yeah. when you die. Like people just start sharing it. Like, people yeah. want to see like who this person was because now that they're they dead, just want to be in conversation. Like, yeah. People wow. want to feel like they knew who you were uh. so they could say like, they could feel bad about it. Yeah. <laughs> very true. Yeah. Hey. Hey. Y- y'all seen that shit with Lil Tay? Yeah, yeah, I was just yeah, gonna yeah. say that. Oh she didn't die. Yeah, they said it was She's right here. But- right, for real. <laughs> this is her. She grew up. <laughs> 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 All right, well, that's that's Nina. She does crazy things like that. She also, right. w- I think the first time I met you, like actually met you, it was the Grammys after party and you, you oh, and Jimmy yeah. were sneaking into the Grammys. Yeah, I did. It was, yeah. it was me and Jimmy, actually. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know Jimmy. Let's circle back to that because I want to hear yeah. Peter. What do you do, Peter? Um, I just date Nina. That's about it. Oh. No, he does not. No, he does is this not, not hey, true, Nina? No, Don't be shy. Why not. would Peter say that if it was a lie? Well, Peter says a lot of things, you feel me? And not all of them are true. So I've, as long I'll as I've known Peter, right I've never known him to be a liar. Never been that's, a liar. Well, that's the biggest cap. Hold on, Nina. Let's just go public with this. Uh, I'm not going to lie to you, Peter. We, we, we need to talk about this, okay? Off camera? I'm going to be honest with you. This is my brother from another Ooh. mother. Oh, I don't know. Oh, I don't wait, know whether it would be a pain or if that Yeah, yeah. You just, she just. Friends on you live. Yeah. Yeah. Girls like doing that. Like publicly, like, they want to be like all friends, but behind closed doors, it's oh, yeah. like you feel me? Oh, really? I will yeah. remind you again Sorry. that is Peter's friend right there. No, okay. I just, I'm just kind of tired of being kept Wait. as a secret. Hey, if, so. if anyone was even less of a liar than Peter, it'd be Bachi though. So <laughs> oh, for, oh, I know that's the biggest cap Bocci you ever said. Never Come lie. on now. Never, hey, look at that face. He could never lie. Listen, to I'm me. from New York. We don't really cap over there. So Wait then. You just said. You just said. You just said. Because you're from New Jersey. What the hell? I said, we'll talk, you don't know that because you're from New Jersey. Don't try to join in these jokes, all right? <laughs> Sorry, I'm in the corner right here. Hey, but the reason, why, the reason why I believe these two is because why would you be traveling from New York with him every Come on now, that hey, travel every hey, I like someone that uses their brain, you know? Because we do a lot of the same shit, like the Ooh, podcast, I, uh, you guys ask hey. me. So you happen to randomly meet and you're always doing the same things? Well, I met Wu Talk over there. He said he has his bonsai party. Somebody's smart around here. Right, he has his bonsai party. I said, okay, bet. And then he said, oh, shit, I'm going too. So we're like, all right, bet. Because we've been traveling together. No, 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 no. Exactly, traveling together. I said, friends. Can we not travel as friends? Wait, wait, wait. Why don't you... But you know, guys and girls can't really be that close friends. Thank that's you. Guys, but that's, hey, why, that's why I live in New York this and he lives in Texas. Group, you guys, yeah. you guys, why are y'all so successful? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> For real, like, y'all, but there's y'all one thing about me. I, I, don't, all that shit. Yeah. I, I don't do that. I don't Good do that. analyzation. So. What, you think he's ugly? Oh, my God. I think... Um, oh, oh this is a long like, point. Yeah, no way. Oh, hey, great, to, great to look at. Great to look at. Yeah. I agree. Okay. Get out of here. Great to look at. Great to look at. You guys remind me. But not me really of, my, my taste. I'm gonna but literally kill myself. Yes. You're great to look at. It's okay. Time. You keep it hey, to yourself. Peter. Say it with your chest. Okay, why, why are you anything. pretending like you you don't know how to talk? What? Everyone, excuse me if it has something to yeah, say. Yeah, I got you. Next no, time, no. tie me on the shoulder. I got you. Yes, Vic. Go ahead. Yes, Vic. The joke's dead. No, you gotta yeah, say it. Okay. Make my joke. We literally we'll just laugh. laid out the whole red red. We got an editor. We got an editor. We got an editor. Like he chop it. I was gonna say. I was gonna say. You guys remind me of someone I used to know. Oh. Somebody else. Say it louder. No. Say it louder. It's automatic ooh, views. Ooh, Say it no. louder. He said motto. Who? Oh, <laughs> we, we used to be in love. <laughs> Do you guys know who that like is? Mar- huh? Do you guys know who that is? Oh, you guys. Do you remind yeah, 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 yeah. you of someone Wait, else? Are we allowed to talk about ooh. that? Is is Jeremy it's the same, and I? It's the same, it's the same and I? dynamic yeah, of y'all two. Wait, is she the one that you said was like, had this like special type of personality? Yeah. When I, when I go through my days, I like, Sometimes I'll randomly remember. I walked smile. into Vitz's room one time and he had a closet open and it was just uh. pictures of Madu and he slams that shit shut. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, why are you god. supposed to knock? Oh my god. Oh shit. Oh. Started anyway. tearing it off. Wait, wait, you, wait, you said we, we remind you of. No, no, no. Peter, Peter oh. and Nina. Oh, no, I'm single. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> well, well, let's back That's up. That's what she used to say too. Nah. Single, <laughs> they're single, out single. at a party. They're like, single. oh, are you guys taken? And Vitz, like, I'm taken by her. And she's like, I'm single. <laughs> But right. Peter, who, what, do you, what do you do? Uh, I used to make TikToks with my family a lot. Mm-hmm. But then I, I, I low-key been taking a break from that, too. How long has this break been? Uh, I 
posted like maybe once this year, once or twice this year. I keep telling myself I'm gonna start again. But then, like, it's so weird, like, getting back in the groove of making videos every day. Yeah, it's a grind. Yeah, especially when you get used to, like, having your own privacy and, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? It's, it, but I definitely want to start doing it again. But uh, I do business on the side. What uh, what type of business? Um, I work in nightlife. Uh, I have a restaurant and a nail salon. You think it's Shout them out. Where can they find the restaurant and the nightlife and the events? <laughs> the <laughs> nightlife. Where can they find the nightlife? Wait, how come we didn't go to the restaurant? Huh? When we went to, oh. It wasn't open, I yeah. think. I also it's didn't open, know about it like, until like... He's redoing like, I'm Austin. I'm rebranding. I'm yeah. redoing oh, the whole thing right now. All right, give yourself a shout out, man. Peter Bowie. No, 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 no. What's the, the name of your <laughs> night? <laughs> oh, it's under construction. Can't drop the name just yet. Okay. If you guys yeah. follow my page, I linked all the restaurant and the mm. nail lounge or whatever. So if y'all follow that page... I'll catch a rebound. I will say they do do nice. really good nails. Whoever's yeah, time stamping, uh, put a note to put it on screen as yeah, he but says hey, that. If we want a party, where where do they go? Eclipse Group, Texas. And you're throwing parties in Dallas, all across the U.S. Oh, mm. oh really? Mm. Where? What other Global cities outside of Texas? Family? So, uh, for like weeklies or like monthly events, we do events mostly in Dallas, uh, Fort Worth, Carrollton, Houston, Austin. But then we also do like. Management, tour management, concerts, festivals. Global. Like, yeah. You feel me? We did the North Star Boys tour. Yeah, they were in Boston, like, New York, too. Damn. Yeah. They, and you did Sweet Tea? That's such a... Oh, we did yeah. Sweet Tea. And then oh, yeah. did you help uh, You Should Know? Yeah, we did that. We did their after party for that one as well. Yeah. Yeah. Fire. I like oh this little, little community going on. Man. And he's a young man, too. How old are you? I'm 22. Damn. Man, I don't like how I went after him. Why? Because night like mine nah, like stop, stop. <laughs> explain yourself, Bachi. <laughs> All right, my name is Bachi. I do YouTube and I I like blew up blew up off like the red stuff. But like I'm trying to like repurpose now, like rebrand and just more like something more meaningful as I'm getting older. Riz isn't meaningful to you. I mean, it's like like Peter told me like that's just like five percent of me. Yeah, you know. So like I'm just trying to do something more like inspirational because like I do have a personality, mm -hmm. and so just trying to yeah just and you can ball. documenting my life. I, I, didn't re I didn't realize you could play basketball in nah, the video. I'm all right. I'm all right. Yeah, he's he's nice. also very humble. Yeah, he's why, nice. Why don't you just take the GOYs, bro? <laughs> GOYs who? You don't know who GOYs is? That's a dude. Oh, GOYs? You don't want to take it's that route. It's the same issue. Man. He doesn't want to display only 5% of his interest. I will say this, though. I think it was similar for me, right? I did bartending content to, to make my career. Mm -hmm. But I rode that shit out for, like, years, right? And it's like, definitely at a certain point, I'm like, there's so much more to me. There's so much more I want to do. But at the end right. of the day, like whatever you you want to take the shortest path to success first, because if you try to, if you dilute yourself too soon, like you know what I'm saying, like you might you might have like this rocket ship to where you want to go, mm. and then you're like, oh, but there's just so much more to me. Like you'll figure that out later, you know. Like get mm. to where you get to where you're safe first. I think mm. I agree with that. Yeah. Like niching, figuring out your exactly. niche. Exactly. But like, like, don't you tough, think you know like don't so, you don't you think like getting to where you're safe, like getting there too fast if, uh, on like some it's like you're not growing it gradually your fan base so like sometimes it's like easy come easy go i think it's, way easier, it's way easier to rebrand than what were you what I'm, I'm not really following he's, he's scared that if he if he like if you continue making the rising thing that's all he's going to be known for yeah, he's going to corner him so. hey bro yeah. Yeah. Like the there was the two million people that follow me for bartending and now i teach them about health i say my opinions on a podcast you know and what i'm saying like uh. it, it is it's not as hard to rebrand as you think, but mm, it's just yeah. like, you, a lot of people, what it is, it's, it's their own brain that stops them. If I was like, oh man, I don't want to start a new page to post health content because there's a chance it doesn't get as many views and I'm used to getting this many views like right. as a standard, like it's like an almost an embarrassment factor, but you can't, that's what you can't let stop you. Like, mm. just like when you started the Riz videos, it took you a lot of videos for people to catch on to be like, oh, this guy has Riz, this guy's funny, right? Mm -hmm. It should think about it just like you're just starting again the same way. Like you can't have this ego just because you're this person now yeah not only that it's like my personal life too mm -hmm. i go in the public everybody's like oh yeah he get bitches isn't that like oh I don't, what, like, what I don't a terrible know. thing to be known yeah. for like, he's like but i get no Jeez. bitches <laughs> he's like please <laughs> listen listen and please the guy, stop thinking i get I'm bitches i'm human too just let me live yeah. it's like <laughs> Guys will go up to me and be like, raise me up, raise me up. I'm like, guys? Yeah. <laughs> like, I'll be, I'll be working on my job. Hey, wait a minute. I used to work R a job. Riz me up bro. right now. What's up? See? Live Riz <laughs> show. Yeah, yeah. It's like when a comedian, tell us a joke. Tell us a joke. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I've seen, saying. after I met him, I started to get some of the, the TikToks on my For You page and shit. I did. And, and it was funny because I was like, well, it, one, it was genuinely like he's confident in that shit. Like, it's, what is it, like Omegle? And then you're like meeting random girls on there? Yeah. Yeah. And then he'll always caption it like, 
this Asian guy got the most riz. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, so what do you do on Omigo? You just get, you just get on humble. there? I'm humble. I you get just on get there, on there flirts. and then so I'll... Omigo, they pair you with a random person. I'm, random I'm old, people. I understand. Uh, I know what Omigo is. Yeah. Oh, I've been on there. <laughs> and I used to no, sit so on there for hours. So you like basically hours. just meet oh, girls? Hours. Yeah, Those it's not as easy. Hours. Like, no. There's a lot of random people too. And then, and then a lot of dudes that show on the Yeah, they wee-wees and like, you know? What Omigo? Yeah, the meanwhile I get because we tried it out in like high school and shit, like just for funsies and shit, and like funsies. recently, like, like you get like, connected to you random get to people. people. I was like, okay, she talking about Skype. Was fucking balls and dicks. I was like, yeah, what the yeah, fuck yeah. is going on? No, like, some people are sick on there. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, like, I, feel like, I feel like New York Omigo is just you two pointing guns at each other. Where you at? Yeah, no, 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 no. we just like what, bitch? We just like roast each other. We don't. <laughs> it's do just nothing. fighting. You just get on there to fight. Motherfuckers punch the camera. They just be racist as hell. Like out of nowhere, they'd be like, "You fucking chink," and I'm like, "Yeah." Well, Wait, you're no. there like, hey, uh, are you ready to make a new friend? You chink, shut up. Yeah, exactly, no. <laughs> no, there will actually be like hella racist on there. Yeah, but then, I mean, it's, it's People regular. People love to talk normal. shit through a camera, you know? Yeah, for sure. My favorite videos are the ones where uh, like some fucking like computer genius is like finessing the Omegle to like, you would think you think that like it skipped oh, to the yeah. next oh, person, yeah. but then and he like back. shows up in the mm. background of like the next person. Yeah. Like yeah. they're like playing out like kidnapping skits and shit, yeah, and it's just fucking wild. Wait, we should I think do so. That. I think so. It's it's exactly. so. I don't know how he that fucking does so it, but funny. it's literally genius. And I, but it's also crazy because like I did it when it was it was like early on, mm. like not a lot of people did the Riz stuff and the mm. Amigo. It was like me. Ghetto Filipino, I don't know if you, he blew up no. by KSI. Ghetto <laughs> Filipino, man, hey, shout out crazy, yeah, yeah, you know, you know. But like, now that I see all the Riz Omegle stuff, I'm like, damn, like, I ain't gonna, I don't want to say it like that, but like, oh, you're a trendsetter. <laughs> not like that, but, but that's like, what I mean, bro. Is that if you, I feel like if you took it serious, if you like didn't try to like uh, diversify too soon. You mm. would be a lot bigger for that stuff. And it may not be what you want to do the rest of your life, but you don't have to do it the rest of your life is what I'm saying. Mm. You're still so yeah, young. And another, another bread, thing like, you could have done, you could have transitioned it into like streaming. Yeah. Done that live with the whole audience. Yep. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah. There that. might have yeah. been way too many dicks for that, so I don't know. Uh, oh, no, you, you just cover your screen. You, you just, just have to look at dicks all the time. Just get OnlyFans, Bossy. You can make money. Hours Don't worry. of dicks. Man, I saw a lot. I ain't gonna lie. Just go make OnlyFans. <laughs> I don't, I'm not gonna lie, it, it really desensitized me doing Damn. that stuff. Like, before I was very, like, sh- I mean, even <laughs> that, too. Like, <laughs> like now talking to the girls and, like, ass. like, like now you it's just like talking to girls. What you like, were saying to girls. Exactly, yeah. exactly. Now it's just uh, like it's whatever. I will say when I met him, he's very young, right? And he just had, he was very introspective about his relationship with girls and like hookup culture and stuff. And I was like surprised. I was like, damn. Mm. Oh I, really? Yeah. I didn't know you analyzed. Hey. Yeah, yeah. Smart people over here. Yeah. You know? Smart aren't people. You, aren't, aren't, aren't you celibate? Celibate. Or celibate for <laughs> where, where you at one point celibate? Hey. Uh, um. Right now I am. I quit. Like a lot of <laughs> quit. I quit. No, no, no. I quit a lot so of I went like to rehab. <clears throat> like I'm still human. You know yeah, what I mean? Like I, I still, was a pussy addict. I st- I'm still human. <laughs> I still mess up a lot, but like I'm still trying to. I'm trying to like go back to church. What is messing up? Drugs. What is messing up? Messing up is like. I don't want to get into that? detail, but like he has to put his this is a podcast. On. Like He's girls. Like, Oops. Fell. <laughs> <laughs> Oops. Yeah. I tripped. No, 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 no it's more pussy. like like drugs involved and like girls like they will offer me mm. th- like to just smoke let's just say mm. yeah damn y'all celibate yeah are we oh yeah. are we you we, we is crazy i'm very <laughs> celibate thank you yeah, we are i am <laughs> very celibate wait i want to know nina's type in a, in a oh, man. Right there. Or a woman. I swear to God. I swear to God. Spiky hair, handsome face, fit in a man. Double earring. We asked her before. I swear to God, she described me. I swear no, I did not. Okay, okay. Well, number one, let's he let, doesn't let's even let make the cuff not a tree. So that's different. Are you a tree? What's a, what well, does that even mean? My definition of, of a wholesome <laughs> is very different from other people. Wait, wait, wait. I want Jeremy to guess what a tree is. Jeremy, you know what a tree is? Guess. Is it a tree or a tree? A tree. So say it in a sentence again. But use a trish. I'm a trish. <laughs> it's real context. Yes. <laughs> but use it in a 
<laughs> what the fuck? I see a trish walking down the street. No, no, yeah. Like man, these trishes out in these clubs. Yeah, these trishes oh, be, be. Oh, is it like a man thought? <laughs> what the fuck? Okay, just a thought in general. Oh, okay, it's not okay. gender like, specific. Like an ultra, like an ultra. Thought. Where does trish come? Thought is like, like thought makes sense. Like, what's trish? What's how does thought make sense? That, that hoe over, over there. It's from trish? the French word. Wait, thought means that hoe. Yeah, that hoe. That hoe over there. That's why it's acronym. Oh, what? Yeah. And how does slut make sense? Where does slut come from? Somebody uh, exactly the words. Whoever made it is a modern day Shakespeare, and they should be given their flowers. Yeah, I think trish is fire. There's a lot of new terms. It must, trish it must be fire. pop smoke that made trish. Trish. Okay. Cali got like skeletes. I'm sure they I've never heard. I never heard that. We do not. Uh, oh, I promise you, that's not for. That me. sounds like, like a Harry uh, Potter spell. <laughs> 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 Texas is like like hoochie. What, what, like, what do you cast? I have no idea. It says like what? what do okay, so, like, hey, wait, wait. Okay, so why so. are you calling him a trish? That's a trish? your man. That's not my man. Yeah. yeah. What I does that say about you though. if he's a trish? Oh, I, I treat him better. Opposite end. I am no part in that trishing. You land. need to treat that's your man better. He's obviously he's trying to make up for something that's lacking at home. Like a friend, a very good friend. Was there a just dead honest? Was there anything between you and you fucked it up? It sounds like it. Or did she fuck it up? No. I don't think any of us I think this is a anything. great question. I don't think, I don't think <laughs> anyone yeah. fucked up anything. Oh. oh hey, there's some pain on my boy's face. Yeah, you, sound, you sound guilty now. No, there was nothing there. So there's nothing to fuck up on. Mm. Did you want something to be there? And she broke your heart? Uh, uh, no. Don't do that guilty shit, bitch. The fuck? One thing my, par- <laughs> my parents... <laughs> over here, over here, like, one thing my parents always told me to do was not lie. <laughs> Stop. And so, I've seen that within so you, you Peter. you lie. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. next question. God, hey, but okay. Me. So maybe pre Nina, were you ever a trish, Mister Peter? Pre Nina? No. Huh? I mean, I feel like everybody goes through their little phases. So yeah, see. <laughs> How how's your uh, celibacy? It's going. Going. It's going. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead. It's going out the window. <laughs> no, <laughs> Running far away. Out the window. Wow. <laughs> it already left. <laughs> oh man. Uh, trying then, my trying my darndest to keep to it. How you doing? I've been pretty good. I've been pretty good. Pretty do you meditate? Good. Like, how good? How good? Like, how good? good, good or like, like great? Wait, wait, I have a question. When you get frustrated, what do you do? When I get frustrated? Yeah, when you get like sexually frustrated. frustrated. Oh. He like, just rubs him? against do furniture. You- oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> he just stands <laughs> naked on his roof <laughs> on a windy day. He's like, please. I do not want to sit here anymore. <laughs> Which and wall is your favorite? Do you like <laughs> I usually wall, just, or? I straddle a pillow when I sleep so it feels like a woman. Oh my God. Yeah, and I just go to sleep. And then Vit. You're, uh, I'm a good. I stand ten toes on everything I say. I told myself I would be absent. I've been absent. He still kisses wow. girls at the club, though. They That's molest okay. me. They molest me. They know I'm drunk and they attack oh me. They be taking advantage so of me. So it's him. not your fault at all. It's not my fault. fault. He's it's like, why did I do that, Wu Tang? She's following me. <laughs> yeah. Literally, I'll tell my friends like, "Hey, I need you to save me. This girl won't leave me alone." Because right. I'll come up and talk to them. Because like I'm out drinking, I might as well flirt a little bit. Oh damn! Have some fun in right. the moment. Then so they right, hit him against right. the wall. Uh, against his will. Next thing I know, we're Listen, kissing. You're in your room. No, next thing I know, we're kissing, and then I'm like, "Oh, this is going too far. I can't have this." Oh. I can't have this. immediately. <laughs> but after he kisses them, hey, that's the point. Is like, immediately yeah. pukes can, in his hands. You can say no. He's disgusted yeah. by well, it. No. Or just stay home. That's what I would never do that. <laughs> I'm out to network. It's LA. Okay. Good. But well, networking requires mouth, after, mouth action like that. Sometimes it does. Really? After we kiss, I'm like. I cannot allow this anymore. Right. I tell, I turn to my friends and I'm like, hey, save me. Get this girl away from me. And I can vouch for that. I will say gir- girls don't take the hint though because they're not used to that. Bro. Yeah. Most of the time I dead ass like, like we'll make out or whatever and I'll pull away and I'll literally turn the other way and talk to like other people. Like oh. get the hint. Move. Yeah. Please leave me alone. He was like, doing, it, was, yeah. it was like a cat and mouse game with him and this one girl like throughout the whole bar. Like she would show up and he would leave and then she was like, where'd Vic go? And I thought it was funny. So I'd be like, he's, <laughs> she's following him. What? Yeah. And then he, and then I see him circle back. She's like, yo, how does she keep finding me? <laughs> she pulls up, yo, that way. <laughs> and I walked away one time and she literally gripped like my side. She was like, she gripped my shit and pulled me back. Cage? I'm like, yo, yeah. chill. To, wait, where to, was this? Damn. Damn, oh, yeah, you, need, you need like security guard at all times. This is crazy. But yeah, he's, he's other than my my sometimes making out with people, like <laughs> I haven't had sex okay. in almost six months. Wow, 
Clap That's good shit. Hey, what did you? What did you hey, what did you tell me the other day? That was hilarious. Oh, when <laughs> when I when I officially hit six months, I'm gonna give myself a little treat. I will fuck one girl, and then I'm gonna go back. One to girl, and go mm-hmm. back. Okay. Just like a reward. Hey, all you all know? the girls watching the show and shit. Pick me, pick me. Hey, we're gonna actually turn it into a sweepstakes a at UTI. A yeah. We're only picking from if you're subscribed to the fourth wall yeah. <laughs> yep. under the influence that show. If you're on our exclusive bonus content bonus content platform, you will and have a chance. And if you take a video, you swallowing bonsai. Oh yeah, yeah. And we're gonna do a little product ad break. Random ad break. Cue the music. Anyways, uh, the show is sponsored by Nectar Hard Seltzer. Unique yes. Asian flavors, no, no weird aftertaste. aftertaste. We got everybody drinking it right now. That's right. And we just pulled up to Texas. So if you're in Texas, go to HEBs, look on the website. California, go everywhere. And Hawaii, go everywhere. And fun little thing, I think this will drop at the same time. So as you guys are aware, Hawaii has been very good to Nectar, and they're going through a very difficult time with Maui. So we and our suppliers are donating a sum of money. And then we're also going to be releasing the spirit pack that was all sold out. We're going to be releasing it in California and Washington as well. And a large <clears throat> uh, large portion of those profits will go towards Maui as well. So Damn, y'all going to heaven. Y'all going to heaven for yes. real. President. So, Jeremy way to heaven. Let's so, go. Yes. Jeremy Biden. So, by drinking, you can support Maui. And even if you don't live in Hawaii, you can support them. Hawaii, it's obviously all over the islands, and we're going to be donating a lot of the money from that to Maui. So I got I can talk for hours. That whole Maui thing is a crazy it conspiracy. It is crazy. Wow. Uh, let's uh, not get yeah. into that. We so, get demonetized. Yeah, if, if you're in California and Washington, you'll get to try the two new flavors. And last but not least, Variety Pack 2 is coming. Stay tuned. There's wow. a lot of stuff. I'll, I'll keep it short because Jeremy just took up the whole ad slot time. If you want to stop being hungover, Super Recovery by Super Bonsai. It works. It I works. I promise you it works. And even if you don't drink enough to get hungover, it is eight natural ingredients and it's great for your liver health. It's like wearing a condom over your liver every time you drink. So you should practice safe sips. But mm. also I want to add... There was somebody in the Discord that drank like an aggressive amount. Oh yeah, there's a point of no return always, yes. guys. Don't don't sit there and get the drunkest you've ever been in your life. But here's and then throw up. Okay, don't look at and me. Also, Do not look at me. If you throw up while you're drinking, you also have a very high chance you threw up all the pills and oh, it's not going to help you at that point. So no wonder it didn't that's work. another thing. Don't there's always a point of no return, but it is night and day from when you drink without it and anyone that uses it and drinks without it and uses it realizes, ah oh, fuck, I can't be drinking without that shit no oh, more. Oh wait, wait, wait. The yeah. Uber the Uber. Oh, our, our Uber driver Whoa. driver's back. Wait, everybody take the super bonsai first. Let's get it. Let's what? get it. Danny Danny take the super bonsai first. Oh, yeah, Danny yeah. Rio, yeah. the best hold bartender. Hold on, hold on. But wait, we don't wait. take that without taking Super Bonsai. Oh, wow. Hi, Hi, Danny, in case you didn't know. Hi, Danny. Hi, hey. Esther. I've just been That's here my wife. My Hi, podcast. Barbie. This is my Hi, wife. Barbie. Those are our kids Talk over here. Talk to the mic. Talk to the mic. That's our sons <laughs> over there. You do look like Barbie with your pink hair. Like she it? does. Make sure you're talking yeah. to the mic. Oh, hi. Hey, hi. This is my mic. I don't know about you guys. <laughs> And listen, I, something I want to say. Let's Wait, say you go a little overboard. Wait, you oh, you can't take shots. Is there a thing in here? I'm not going to force you. you just v, you good okay. on this? No, I can't. Oh, I can't. It's back. a Monday. Yeah, 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 I'm good on Esther, this. We didn't talk about your thing. back. Oh. Uh, you can show me how sparkling Oh, I'm going to take a sparkling All right. She did. She did too. So just one extra. Side bet. Me and Bachi made a bet at the beginning of the show of how many takes it would take Nina to do the intro. Wait, 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 and everybody. I'll suck my dick, for real. I'm okay. sick. I'm not going to, I can't drink. <laughs> okay. Suck it. Hard. All right. The shots so, hey, Wu Talk, give, give the camera sit down. I know and, that if oh, I drink, I'm going to want to dance and my back is broken. You can show them. not just going to the three. wake up hungover. All right, everybody's <laughs> three pills. That's three pills. Everybody. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> that looks like teeth. Oh, no. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Look at the camera. Yeah, it looks, yeah, looks like, like Chinese. Oh shit. By now, you've seen us drink this beautiful drink, and this is Nectar Hard Seltzer, the first Asian-inspired hard seltzer featuring delicious flavors like Asian pear, lychee, mandarin, and yuzu. Now, unlike all those big brands out there that have the disgusting aftertaste, we got rid of it. There is no weird aftertaste in this. We actually started Nectar two years ago out of my garage, and because of a viral TikTok, we took off. And because of supporters like you, we've now expanded Nectar into five states, California, Hawaii, Washington, New York, and New Jersey. 
Jersey. If you'd like to get a box of Nectar, here are four easy options to choose from. Go to our website, NectarHardSeltzer.com, click on the store locator, and the store closest to you will pop right up. If we're not in any stores near you, next time you're in your favorite store, ask the manager to stock us. You'll be genuinely surprised how well that works. And if we're not in any stores near you yet, or we're not in your city, you can order us online. We ship to 45 states. And if we can't ship to you, send us a text. That tells us where we need to go next. Drink Nectar Hard Seltzer, unique Asian flavors, and no weird aftertaste. Now back to whatever the hell they're talking about. Transition back in. All right, we have a... So the title of this episode is going to be Vietnamese versus Korean race war. Oh, I'm ready. Let's go. Yeah. Vietnamese are better. So basically, basically, (laughs) that's not actually Yeah, yeah, you're done. No, no, you're just, you're team Vietnamese for today. Just, you're you're an honorary Vietnamese. Okay, bad, 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 but we'll, we'll take She's you. She's we'll Korean. You. All right, so Nina is team Korea. But anyways, we have our... Actually, switch it back. We have our Vietnamese here. The three Ban Mi boys. The Ban Mi and, um, boys. And he, he feels sometimes like he's just outnumbered with all these Koreans. I have to call in backup. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So, you know, now he's finally got some of his brethren on here. Mm-hmm. So we got just a couple questions related to the, the Viet Korean culture side of things. Who got the bigger Schmidt? No, I'm just kidding. That's Chinese. not the question. That was hey, not right. Everybody whip it out right now. <laughs> Jeremy is obsessed with Schmidt sizes for some reason. Who? The first question is, who is more toxic? Korean men or Vietnamese men? No, I want to hear Nina's Nina's answer first because she's... That's easy. Dating a Viet guy. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not dating a Viet guy. I'm not dating a Viet guy. No, because she's not Vietnamese so, or yeah. Korean. Oh, yeah, so I'm in the middle. That's perfect. Yeah, so she's in the middle. Right. Yeah. I know so you're I'll be honest, the that. best hubby material is Chinese. I will say that. I'm hey, not, that not, Chinese not, not in the question. I heard, that. I heard this. Cut that. Not because, not Try again. I'm Chinese, but it's true. No, I heard this. They're they're really nice to the girl. They're very hubby material. Yes, yes, I heard this. Make sure you're talking to Mike. Do you guys know that Nice guys don't ever win, so that's well, not true. They do in Chinese books. No, they don't. No, they don't. Well, you mm-hmm. don't read Chinese books. I, so. I know about this. Yes, I, I know do. About this. They're, they're very. What's so <laughs> What's so great about Chinese men? No, because they cater they to the salty women right now. They cater to the. They cater to the. Yeah, they cater hey, your, to the your Vietnamese, Vietnamese girls, boyfriend is right girls, there. I don't have. Boyfriend. Wait, talk to the mic. But the oh, I don't have boyfriend. But the girls, they're um, what's it called? They're like queens. Yes. They treat them like queens. They're high maintenance too, so they be asking and the. Oh, they're, they're very deliver. brutal. Like females yes. or so Chinese, saying, they're like. I all Chinese this, this, men this. are betas. Yes. You mean they're simps? I yes. do like yeah. simps. So. Yeah, beta mm. simp type. Is that your type of man, a simp? Not a full on, but like you, you know, what's you like can lose right, sometimes. What's the right? What's the right I could level never. of simp? Yeah. I'd, like, I'd rather leave my girl than lose an argument. Like you could be your own person. Like you could be your own person, right? But when y'all arguing shit, just be more reasonable, you know? Mm, nope. Like that's it. <laughs> exactly. Nope. So, hey, I think we're okay. Wait, wait, wait. Let's exactly. re-ask the question. Let's Chinese re-ask the men. question. Chinese men were never in the. I don't know why we just created an I just option added C. It. I add. I have my but, own uh, category. But we all know what he is. He's Vietnamese. You heard his answers. Audience, comment down below. Vietnamese men or Korean men? Who is more toxic? Korean what do, men. What do you guys think? I would say Viet girls are more toxic, but Korean men are more toxic. Correct. You think that's correct? I 100% yeah. agree with that, though. What? Explain. No, no, no. Oh. He said, oh. Jeremy said, oh. Um, I don't know. I've never dated a Korean man. What do you mean? You fucking liar. <laughs> Dude, look at him. You lying look, on the camera and shit. Yeah, what the fuck? <laughs> hey, uh, I will say... It's okay. <laughs> you guys can get toxic, too, though. I've never but... seen a toxic Korean man in my life. Really? Yeah. Well, actually... Wait. All right. I don't know if we allowed to. Is it true Korean men be like beating up on their wives a lot? What? So do Vietnamese men. I feel like just men, men I think shitty that's a, men that across. Any, yeah. any man. Yeah. 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 Just don't it's, Chinese. It has yeah. nothing to do with race. It has to do with being shitty. Uh, I just heard like statistically, like it's like Koreans. They like said interview there. for you is yeah. over. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> wait, wait, bring out the statistic right now. <laughs> Where are you seeing that statistic? I feel like I hate KoreanMen.com. I feel like Viet is more like. It's like modernized in terms oh, of like Korean. Really? It's like it's like you, you gotta be quiet. Just go in the kitchen. You think the Vietnamese are more modernized than the Koreans? I think so. No, I wouldn't say so. I, I would I say like so. the Korean men are like the hot temper ones, but then the Viet people be like the alcoholics. Mm. They don't. Really? Korean men are also alcoholic. Vietnamese don't have hot tempers. I feel like y'all alcoholics in like a cute way, but like Viet people like. What's you a know cute what I'm way to about? be like an the, the uncles that just be like drunk all yeah, the time. Yeah, oh, you mean like yeah, a yeah. gross alcoholic? Yeah. Nah, I've seen some gross alcoholics that I think alcoholics in general nothing cute. Yeah, I, I think Korean I, men yeah. get mad when their girl is prettier than them. 
<laughs> really? I think Korean men grow up and want to be idols, and they're like, oh, you look better than me? I will right. never achieve my dream. Where the fuck Wait, does bro. that come from? Wait, are you talking about talk? No, I think all Korean men are like that. I've read that. All <laughs> way. So you think you yeah, have yeah. two Korean men sitting right here. You think we're like that? Where did you read oh, that? I'm on I Hate Korean Men. <laughs> <laughs> And we look at the bottom of the website, it's like, Vit Trap is the author. <laughs> I think both, both I mean, are articles every day. With power. It's like the statistics yeah. show. <laughs> well, I want to know where the Wait, statistics you guys know, are saying are coming from. I don't think we from. know anything about this topic. I don't know. I, <laughs> as a big a guy, I know I'm going to be like a great boyfriend, that's all. Like, as a big guy, guy I'm, same, same that's, what I'm Not. that's the biggest. You yeah. won't be. All I'm saying is, is this is a prime example of what y'all are yeah, like, yeah, right? I was about to say. No. <laughs> he like an anomaly. Like. Yeah. I would I would fucking die before I was ever toxic to a woman. <laughs> so would I. No, you wouldn't. That's why I try to kill myself. <laughs> well, now. Because every day like, I fail to today, I have to die. <laughs> uh, to be honest, big girls are like talk, uh, love crazy. If I'm a pick for real, for real, I would definitely say Korean men are probably a little bit more toxic. Just a little wow. bit though. Y'all are not far behind. Let's not, get, toxic, though? let's not get crazy. I think toxic. Korean men gaslight more. I think Vietnamese men just go straight to beating their wives. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. There we go. There Maybe. we go. Maybe. Yeah. Really? There we go. You're gonna have to fix this, those statistics, buddy boy. Yeah, yeah. I look into it. <laughs> yeah, I, I hate Koreanmen.com's founder <laughs> said that Vietnamese men beat their wives more. I've been, I've been wow. finding, I've been finding a lot of new companies this year. <laughs> wow, every, every day. Okay, but I okay, I think Korean men are slightly more toxic. Okay, but yes, in sir. the general, in okay, the general, the yeah. it's because I deal with Korean men. I'm just like they are hot tempered. That for um, sure, yeah. I also think Vietnamese are hot yeah. tempered though. But the thing is, I don't really know that many Vietnamese guys other than Viet and you guys. All mm. the Vietnamese people I knew were in where I when I grew up was drug dealers, and yeah. so what are you trying to say, man? What? I just think those no, two I cultures. Just, just, I had very few boys dream. are very spoiled. Yeah. That's why they Look grow up to be like that. Korean people, Korean <laughs> boys are spoiled. There's so, so many different I like. No, I feel like Vietnamese too? and and um Korean like the boys in a family yeah. very spoiled. Like Wait, they're very what? spoiled. They're kid. they're put on a pedestal. Yeah, yeah. yeah that's family, why they yeah. get to act the way they yeah. act. I don't know. Yeah, exactly. It's just it's just how it is. Go home. Hey, your girl's tripping right now. I'm just gonna sit here and listen to this. Your girl is tripping right now. No, I'm serious. I turned my ears off five minutes ago. Hey, let me let me put that in check. I dare you, bitch. Do that. Do that. I dare you. I'm right here. Hey, I'm right here. I would love to actually see them be a couple and do that. When we get to the house, we're gonna talk. What house? You finna get your ass beat. That's what's gonna happen. We look out the balcony. Peter's like, I'm sorry. I was just saying that on the podcast. <laughs> I just wanted to be cool for my friends. <laughs> nah, they let Jimmy go going like they be being each other, bro. Like, nah, bro. Nah, like we was, what's like, called? We was um, spicy. We get spicy. It, it don't get spicy like, like that. Freaky. No, <laughs> not freaky like that either. I don't know what that. Man, my man, you watching that stupid shit? But what the fuck? No, that's not it. Oh, well, Wait, I, we but, talks party. I saw Peter and Nina. They were talking, but like they were kind of. Yelling at it, to, but I don't know if that's how they talk. It was, it was, it was like, flirting. Like, oh, lovers it's literally how we talk. No, they it's were just flirting how we talk. with each other. Always, yeah. No, we always yelling. I know. You won't tell them that, <laughs> bitch. I mean, you can. That do it, do it, do it. First time I ever met her, I think this is like the moment I low key caught no. feelings. No. Let him talk. Let him talk. Let him Home talk. Homegirl put a gun to my head. Oh. What was the content? And I loved it. It wasn't even loaded. That's hot. It wasn't that's even toxic. It was not even loaded. I was in the back seat, and I was just like. Like everybody was freaking out except for us. Like everyone was like, Nina, chill. I was looking at her eyes like I was trying to lean in. It's like the lean Disney in. movie oh, where the shit in the back goes like the <laughs> changes no. to like no, stars. First of all, that, I remember that night. I was trying to fucking go back so I can get my damn suitcase to come back to New York. It was the <laughs> second time I met this motherfucker and I was like, what the fuck? Like, I don't know. It was just there. So I just went. We should probably crop that out. No, nah, that's a clip. Yeah, that's, yeah, 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 that's yeah, yeah. being clipped. That's okay. being put on all the so social channels. Yeah. Okay. Love it. First, yeah, just gun license. Gun sight. Don't worry. Right. It's yeah, it's normal in Texas to yeah. do that to your loved ones. Right. Wait, question. You said that Vietnamese women are more love, love toxic? crazy. Love, love crazy. Wait, wait, that's the next question. So it's oh, like yeah, is it Korean women or Viet women are more toxic? I never talked to a Korean mm. ever. Ever? Uh, yeah, I don't know how. You know why? <coughs> why? They're toxic. No, because they're racist. And racist. <laughs> oh, I, I, oh, so yeah, it's like really? a if cultural if thing. Korean women, if you're not Korean, they're not talking to you. I well, I, okay, that one, I wouldn't consider that racist, but like, I do think Korean women take That's, the cake a little bit. Why? Just a little I bit. I just have more experiences well, with Korean women. You ever talked to a Viet girl? Yeah. <laughs> what you think? <laughs> she also ruined crazy. your life, huh? Also crazy. No, no, I, I, oh. didn't, I didn't allow it to ruin my life, but like, yeah. Mm. Right. This is like the first But that's because I had experience from the Korean woman to be like, yeah. this is, 
I need to leave. How like, was she crazy? In what way was she crazy? Yeah, give me an example. The Vietnamese girl or the Korean girl? The Korean girl. Like, yeah. wait, that, what's the that, craziest that, thing she's done to you? The Korean girl would beat me. Oh, wow, yeah. that's good. Actually. In public, actually. I yeah. support that. Yeah. I support that. <laughs> Oh, that's funny. No, nah, domestic abuse is a joke to you. You fucking. I bitch. actually support. Big girls are love crazy. Dude, he they don't it do out the nose. physical yeah. stuff. But anyways, yeah. so yeah, so that's why I give the cake to to Korean women. Okay. I just yeah. started like talking to Viet girls like maybe like this year, last year. With a girlfriend. There's no girlfriend. Talking, I told you. Talking, been said. Like, been said. Like being I don't even like that oh, okay. talking shit. So. Being friends with them. Socially. Being friends with them. Yeah, being yeah, social. Like before I didn't really out, out talk already. to a lot of Viet out people. Already, they were no. bomb as fuck. Like, yeah. I always had this idea in my head. Bomb as fuck or what do you mean? Bomb like, like they're Agent hard. Orange. Like, uh, they yeah. Hard. Growing up around like yeah. just white people in Arkansas, I'm like, yeah. and, then, and then you get to Asian girls, I'm like, damn, like. Because the whole like Asian friend group thing before, I I was always against that. I always thought that was so weird. Like, mm -hmm. it's just if you fuck with somebody, you fuck with them. If not, then you don't. So like seeing people group up just because they're the same race, I'm like, that's, just, it, that's yeah. weird. So then same yeah. way with dating and stuff, I was just like, I even kind of like gravitated away from it because I'm like, same. I'm not finna date an Asian girl just because I'm Asian and she's Asian. But like this year, especially like being in the community and talking to people, there are like a lot of like things that like you don't have to spell out just yeah, because true, you grew up true, with a lot true. of like same culture and it's just like it's kind of cool bro. Like, and I always think about now like mo melding families is a big part oh, of yeah. it too yeah like if they don't understand your lingo that you say yeah. at home is like mm -hmm. yeah but you have an exception though you know what I'm saying yeah. your new type is like Chinese <laughs> highlights I don't right yet. I don't understand yet. New yeah. York Chinese girls New York uh, New York is your thing I swear like I feel that doesn't like New York. Come on. Have you I, ever have you ever talked to a Korean girl? Never. No. I might have, oh, so but I have didn't no, know. You guys have no experience to be speaking on this. Mm. <laughs> What's your love language? Violence. <laughs> but what? Yeah. Uh, physical touch. Just physical no, touch. I don't okay. Think so. Physical beating. <laughs> physical beating is pretty good. I think more like giving. Acts of service. Acts of service. Giving. For sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that's giving. definitely her. Service, yeah. That's definitely her. I'm not really good with like the affectionate word, but like. Same. I can yeah. tell you're not receiving when he's saying he's saying all these nice things about you. Yeah. Oh, no, I don't I've, receive I've, that shit. I've yeah. recently deduced that my one of my love languages is uh, acts of service. His, big, his head. I know, I even if I try to lean into you, <laughs> he's still blocking it. Jeremy, he doesn't your head have to. Is pretty big too. For yeah, let's side. not let's not <laughs> get crazy. <laughs> I, look, I can't look around him. It's like a, I'm wearing a hat. Yeah, pictures. I got a pictures. That's good because then his head is bigger. Your head <laughs> He's like he's like my Nina, and I'm the Peter. What? Yeah, Aww. basically. I got a big ass head. No. <laughs> that's what you're trying to say? Low key, low key, low key. It looks a little big. I do have a big ass Crazy. head. Crazy. No, that's messed up. <laughs> yeah, that's messed maybe. Up. No, it's that's true. Right. No, no, he's. Yeah. Peter, Ooh. I'm Peter because I'd be shooting my shot. At I him. feel like Esther could oh, put out okay. lifting okay. a little bit. Peter be shooting no, his she's shot at you. Head. But you're like, exactly, exactly. Vice, the same thing for us. All right. Uh, okay. So, what was the consensus? Are we gonna say Korean women? Korean say women. Say Vietnamese girls, yo. Why? Cause you're a Korean woman. No, 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 no. I'm different. Second. I am crazy. Vietnamese um, girls are just like talking crazy. Vietnamese girls are pretty toxic. Cause I ha I don't have a lot of Vietnamese guy friends, but I have a lot of Vietnamese girlfriends. And I and I hear what they do, and I'm like. Well, I would never do that. What are they, Give what me are some they examples. Doing? Like what? Um, air them out. Air them out. Lace me up. I mean, actually, I don't know whether or not it's because they're my friends, but their friends as well are a little. That's just like telling them what to do. Like, what do they say? <laughs> no. Like they said um, they'll cut off their dick or something. Like if they. No. Just, one just, of, one of them like ran over her boyfriend with her car. Damn. And then also like on purpose. Also, huh? That's a good one. That's but like not, not like super hard or anything. I don't think that's a Vietnamese. Not like I think super she's just, hard. Why are you making excuses for her? No, 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 no. Okay, but but there's a lot. Of, but there's a lot of things that. Um, yeah. Would you stay with a woman if she hit you with her car? Bro, if a girl did that to me, I'd fall in love right there. <laughs> I'd be he is writing that down. What the fuck? This guy. Well, I can oh see God. why y'all like, work. You care about me that what much that you gonna fuck? like risk your insurance? You gonna hit me with the car? <laughs> like, you gonna bro, pay to fix the dent? Yeah. Yeah. Hey, fix you gonna pay to fix the dent? I know you got money. Hey, what, you know what I'm saying? What if, what if she made you pay to fix the dent? What if she made you pay to fix the dent? Like you dented my car, I had to hit you with my car. I mean, it's the fact that she took the risk of like she's ready to throw her life away. So I'm like. That's hot. That is very good perspective, Peter. That's, I feel you on that one. That's but crazy. except for I wouldn't want to. This wanna, guy's been through even, some I trauma. I wouldn't want to get hit by a car, car but I'll I get I get this dynamic. This guy's just instigating him to ruin his life. <laughs> <laughs> I get this dynamic. All right. 
Well, I, I will uh, say that that was pretty bad. No, nah, um, I won't even hit you with a car. I'll just kill you. I did. I had a Italian woman slap me in the face one time when I was like 18. I still think about her to this day. Wow. Like wow. in what way slap you in the slap. face? I think we were like arguing about something mm -hmm. on our second date and then she slapped me. <laughs> Oh, Immediately, I stopped talking. I stopped arguing. I'm like, damn, that was hot. Yeah, he sat what? down, started behaving. Oh Anything you say, ma'am. Okay. I wouldn't know what to do, man. So y'all like to be baby handles? Me? No, he likes to be baby. Don't he say y'all. Like yeah. Okay, what the fuck what is you baby handled? You the know, he, she's saying you the submissive type. I'll align myself yeah. with that. Oh. Yeah. Okay. At least yeah. you're proud of it. I fuck with that. I'm mad proud of it. What? What? What I think, what I think is toxic amongst both races that are men and women, though, is the possessiveness across the board. Yeah, for sure. Asian women. Asian women. Yeah. Yep. Asian men too, low key. Yeah. Yeah. Very possessive. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Not as uh, much. Is a nail salon or a dry cleaners more profitable? <laughs> dry nail salon. I would nail say salon. nail salon. What? <laughs> yeah, nail salon. Yeah, I'm you build clientele. That. You build clientele. The right clientele. Yeah. The nail salon is gonna run for like dry, sixty years. The dry years. cleaning business is low key going down. You know why? Because a lot of people don't have to go to work in like suits anymore. Oh, and so, or like and they don't have to wear certain clothes to work. Like all these new age companies, you show up in like shorts and a t shirt. You know, I didn't think of that. Yeah. And there's always a new wave of trishes that want like nails. So it's like there's always a new wave. True. <laughs> Every year there's new trishes being and, made. And <laughs> and now I see girl. men. Getting their nails done. Oh, yeah. 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 Like, like, business like is booming. Yo, you feel me? Your booming. fucking business. You're right. you're, you're, buff, your customer base yeah. just doubled. Yeah. No, yeah. not even Self -manicure just. Self manicure day, and then like, I'm like, oh shit, I don't want to do that. Okay. <laughs> Nina, do you like guys who paint their nails? No. You don't like that? No. What about yeah, you, I'm Esther? <laughs> Why is Peter looking at her like. <laughs> He's hiding his nails. <laughs> They're He's literally in his armpits right now. I made her get her nails done for the first time at my at my nail salon, and she was so fucking uncomfortable, bro. Like, that's so cute, man. Oh, Nina's like, how am I gonna punch someone? I can't close my no, fist. No, she, like, she real out. life said that, bro. Yeah. And like, you would see like the nails fall off day by day. <laughs> <laughs> I was the only there for the next three days, and I broke like two. It was, I don't know. It was cute. Though. We did box afterwards <laughs> with the with the thing. We did. It's just. Damn. Dude, it, they it's don't even easy. close. Yeah. Dude, you can't. I'm like, <laughs> like and if you get them short, what's the point of getting them, right? That's so if you true. get to do it, you actually true. do it. What about right? like just like the designs? They look kind of cool. Oh, those are, yeah. oh, that's for little if short. If you have that's like short, if you have, yeah, if you have short nails and you get design on it, it looks like, it's like, yeah, you, you look like doodles on it. You know, yeah. 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 If you do it, just get the hoochie mama nails. Right, just get the hoochie mama nails. Which ones are those? The like long the short ones? ones? Yeah, oh, long ones. Like like, no, 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 no. Nah, no. What type of nails y'all like on a girl? I like it. I don't I like those. They're white, all natural. I, I like yeah. white nails. White nails. Like, like a French. You talking about the super, super long ones? Like, Not super long, but like just like you like those. Yeah, and long then long French like, chicks. Like, wait, so like, like the one that he said French. Oh, no, 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 like half that, half that. Hey, is it a turn off if you were like, hey, what's she, like, let's say you texted a guy and you're like, hey, what kind of nail should I get? And he gives you like the exact thing to say. No, then, no, I think get that's good. Dip. Like, get the, no, the dip? Like the dip? Could do jail, yeah, yeah. Right. Uh -huh. Speaking of Almond. like, Peter. Peter, there's a mic over there. I don't know if you knew about that. Get right coffin here. shaped. Yeah, you gotta they be very close to it. Oh, I'm sorry. If they Go tell ahead. me what they like, I'll do the opposite of that shit. <laughs> But you man, didn't. you're just a menace. You just, hey, why do you just don't not willing to yeah. accept any love from our man over here? <laughs> yeah, save our boy it. Peter. Save can't. our boy Peter. Mm -hmm. If they be like, make it short, I'll make it long. <laughs> if they I say they like, make it black, I'm gonna make it white. Now, what? Just watching this, I think Chinese women are the most toxic. <laughs> what the fuck? Yeah. Yeah. I'll second that. So. Hey, yeah. And I understand why. I, so. I understand why Chinese men have just been beaten into yeah. submission because I can tell why they're so submissive. Because of me. Yeah, what Peter. Poor Peter over here. Great. It's like I'm losing like myself every day. <laughs> oh, but it, I think it's okay though. It she can be. It's not a story again. without an obstacle, you know. Like oh exactly. shit. Right. Like you going no, through it, but like, like no, you'll like, be all right. A dead end to it. You should probably just referring to Nita up, as you know, an obstacle like. is crazy. Yeah. <laughs> no. Uh, there was this comedian Zhao Ying Summers who reminds me of Esther a lot. She uh, she has this bit where some, one of the, some she on a podcast. Somebody's like, "Oh, I feel like dudes who like Asian girls are weird," and she's like, "What they don't know know is that Asian women are the slow death." And then, and then yeah. she starts to describe how like like white dudes think that Asian women are subservient, but it's like low. Like at the end of the day, when I see like a semi-healthy Asian relationship. It's like the woman calling the shots always. Mm -hmm. And this is what I feel like. It's like a, mm. it's like reflected right I do right call there. the shots on everything, but yeah. not in this situation. Cause I'm yeah. Hey, hey, single. that's you bro. Like, I'm thinking of my mom and my dad. Like my mom used to punk my dad. That's good. Yeah. I like that. Really? Yeah. I like that. But um, who has the better food? 
Oh, I was hoping you asked. I was hoping Wait, you asked. Let's let one by one, one, no, one by one. Need a start Nina. as the outsider. Okay, as an outsider, I would say Brando. always Chinese food is better than anything. But, but why are you but, always adding option but, C? But okay, fine. I'll, I'll, I Chinese. think personally, well, I'm from New York, right? So I'll be honest about it. There's a lot more Korean food than Viet food up there. So I, I wonder will why. Say Korean. Sometimes the market decides. But I do like yeah. Viet. Viet food is good too. I, I just had more Korean and mm. more different okay. types, more variety. So Brando. Korean. Yeah, it's Vietnamese. No, no question. You're fired. No question. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That right he there. Like soup. Yeah, you're we done. Have a I'm just kidding. Soup. I'm just kidding. I know you don't need this job. Stay. Yeah. Here. <laughs> <laughs> don't leave. Korean. <laughs> Y'all know our answers. Bro, not even a question. Bro, a question. Yeah. I, and I, I ate a lot of best dish. And we'll put up like. Wait, 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 wait
Oh, Sundubu. Yes. No, 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 not a, not a, that's not a good matchup. Pho or Solong Tang? What is that? Ooh. Oh. What is that? Say, say oh. it. Yeah, we got to take him to Hanba. Oh. Say it. Oh. Fuck them, girl. We're going beef to Hanba. I know what you're going to say. <laughs> say it. Beef, yeah, yeah. beef bone the thing is, like yeah, a clear, like, it's like a milky Salong, Salong soup. Tang all day. It's like better pho. The thing is, yeah. in, in LA, I haven't found a good pho spot. Pho's ass Hanba here. Hanba is, yeah, pho's ass here. Hanba's like the best thing But give me the best pho bowl or the best Salong Tang bowl, I'm still taking pho. Bugging. Yeah, I'm, I'm taking, taking so the, I'm, I'm taking so long time. I always when I go to eat pho. You know why? I get BBH anyway, so what? I, I get Bun BBH what? instead of pho when That's I go to like fire. restaurants. Another reason so why I would better. do KBBQ. Nope. But so long time is good. It's not spicy enough. Y'all Koreans don't have anything spicy. That's because we don't need to cover up our food with pain to make it taste good. The fuck you talking that's about? That's Thai food. That's Thai and loud. They be putting peppers in it. I like that shit. Yeah. Thai There's chilies? no flavor anymore. It's literally like, let me just cry so I forget about how bad this tastes. Yeah. It's like, this is more like a sauce spicy. Anyways, you know? top five Vietnamese foods. Crawfish. Mumba way. What the fuck? Crawfish. You mean oh, like yeah. Houston type like, crawfish? Like, like, like Viet style crawfish? I think that's undefeated. Oh my God. Spring rolls. Yes, Those, uh, rolls. Spring the rolls. gelat... <laughs> Those, those uh, the gelatinous little cups oh, with the shrimp, the dessert, fish sauce. The dessert no, 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 it's, it's not dessert. dessert. Shit. No, it's, it's not a dessert. Appetizer. That's appetizer. good, right? right? No, I know what you're talking about. Though. The fucking the what they call the jung the is it jello the with the beans coconut? And, like, yes, that coconut shit is bomb too. Yeah, I forgot it was like bun bun. Yeah, that was good. But I'm talking about something else. They come in like little cups. It's crispy. Yes, I know. I forgot what it's called. It's like rice paper. Is it have a rice cake? Orange shit on it? No, yes. no, no. Oh, they put shrimp in it. Yep. And uh, and they left the tails in the oh, time I, I tried it. I was like, we oh, ate it at Dai Kao, like yeah, in Houston. Bangkok. Me and him. Bangkok. There you go. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Bangkok. I love when we speak Vietnamese. And Bangsao. 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 It's so good. Like, I never expected it. I'm uh, yeah, I'm still pretty fluent. Yeah, I'm Joy. Like, speaks to my mom, bro. I'm, I'm like, dude, like you're not a felon at all. <laughs> I'm Joy. I'm Joy. Yes, he is. Don't get I'm it twisted. Joy. Viet is a great guy. I am. Actually, no, no, no. When, when I speak English, I have this. Shibar Seki. Yeah. She's just saying. What? what Shibar Seki. She's saying. Shibar Seki. She speaks no, Korean better than you, for real. For would real. you say? Would you say Viet? When I when I, I speak Viet, Jesus Christ, Mina. Oh, sorry. I keep talking. So I go. <laughs> when I speak Vietnamese, yeah. I sound very, very like, just like a like a little boy, like still. a nice guy, yeah. bro. Like a nice, nice guy. guy. <laughs> Wait, can I hear it? Can I hear it? Uh, we wouldn't be able to tell how, how nice he sounds. Yeah, he doesn't speak Viet the way he speaks English. That's, um, like, you know how on like TikTok, he and sounds shit, like, like y'all are bitches. Yeah, you know? Shut yeah, the fuck yeah, up! Yeah. Like, yeah. like, you know why? It's because yeah. I only speak Vietnamese to like my my sister and my mom. So yeah. that's literally just like my natural like yeah, yeah, inflection yeah. Yeah. Mm. versus the way he speaks to us, which is like <laughs> so more hatred. Yeah. yeah, bro. My mom met Viet one time, one time, and then uh, we left the house to like go out for the night. What were we doing? It, it doesn't matter. We were going out. <laughs> I remember now. Anyways, we were going out, and my mom pulls me back inside the house. And this is my, she talked to Viet maybe for like 30 minutes, not even. She, hey, like, I want, like, don't be a bad influence on him. Like, he has a really good heart. And don't like be a bad influence on him. No, nah, seriously. I would have been seriously. like, Mom, you see his face? Am I? Is your mom blind? <laughs> no. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> when That's I, bullshit. I, no, when I hung out with you, my dad, my I called my dad, and he was like, hey, you know, that guy with tattoos, like, don't like, don't be around him. Da, 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 da. I'm like, bro, <laughs> oh my God. like, so I know so Your dad is listen to your father. He's a man. good man. Nah, <laughs> that's just so bad. Like, I was like, dude, you don't even know him. Like, no, no, that's very I, I fully expect that. That's why I like your mom so much. Yeah. Uh, y'all know John, the the streamer. Yeah, he brought his dad to your party. Yeah, yeah, I met and his I was, dad. I was pretty drunk. I was just asking him, like, are you are you in Vietnamese? I was like, are you okay? Do you want anything? He's like, I can take some water. Ran up, grab grabbed him some water, dropped it off. Yeah. Dope. I think and, first time I ever met you. Is that the Vietnamese. end of the story? <laughs> yeah, parents parents love me. Do they actually? Parents love okay, me. Okay, okay, Two cases of parents loving you. Think about in the in the general sense. Nah, when parents meet, but all me, of my yeah, ex's moms uh, mm. loved me before I started in insulting them. <laughs> oh, okay, yeah. Uh, right. <laughs> all right, so it sounds like your record is losing in terms of parents. Now they loved me. I'm a good person. I you, think you uh, are. You are. No, until the so. parents no, wrong me. I actually do think. <laughs> <laughs> you think age is gonna stop me from insulting you? Yeah, you ever had to meet like your girlfriend's parents? Yeah. What was that like? They loved me at first, <laughs> at first. and then they want to get like they want to get in between. They're picking their daughter's sides and shit. And their daughter's wrong. Like, shut up! You're the reason your daughter turned out shit. 
<laughs> yeah, tell him. Hey, stop calling him out by name. First and last name. Yeah. 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 Anyways. Yeah. Uh, I, I think that par- when they, when parents meet Vit, they expect something, and then it's like yeah. he doesn't act like that, and they're like, oh my god, what a good kid. And then they feel bad that they may they have stereotyped that, yeah. him in the beginning, so it's almost like an overcompensation. It's like, it's like being a black friend oh, like He's a really good kid. When he's like, he's a good yeah. kid, but then they're like, wow, he's so much better than I thought he'd be, you know? like Yeah, that's yeah. like bringing like, my best friend, yeah. who's like black, home to my house. It was like hella fucking Chinese, my house. Yeah. It's the same thing. They're like, oh, God. Was that wait, wait, wait. Best friend? My he? Be- my best friend. Is that he? A she. Oh, okay, okay. I thought you said, I thought you had a what man. What you got to say about that shit, bitch? Calm down. Listen, I, 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 I was looking out for you. Don't worry. Oh, fuck. Um, top five Vietnamese foods. We didn't go down the list. Bangkok. We're going to skip you just because oh. I want the, the professional yeah. advice. Man, yeah. fucking yeah. Chashu is the best. I say you never had like, I that, agree. like that jungle shit, like yo, like, you ever yeah. had yo? That's what like is that? real that? shit. Like intestine and like. Oh, Whoa. So fire. I had it. It's good. It's like intestine stir fried with like garlic and spicy shit. Koreans like that shit too. I never really liked intestines. Yeah, you guys, fire. it's so greasy. You gotta cook it right though. It I agree. I've had, so had it. I've had it one time in my Ours life where I liked it, but ours is not that. greasy. So, so what do you, how do y'all cook you. it compared to theirs? It's, I know they it's like it. crispy. We, we grow it's it crispy, crispy, and then it's almost there's, That's there's how like it two has versions. To be. Yeah. There's also like um the the one I liked growing up was uh it was almost like stir fried like steamed. Wait, do you guys do you guys cook uh uh the oil out of the the fat out of the the intestine. Like you guys, you guys drain it or? Yeah, because it's we like, kind of like leave the so for the rice. The you guys put rice stuff. in it. Afterwards. Um, it's like a pork chip, pork chips. Oh, so like it's a, okay. So it's like. Hey, wait, well, you got to go top five down the line. Like you got to keep going. Okay, go top five. He said pho, BBH, BBW. You said those two. <laughs> BBW. BBW. What's that dish? I don't know how to say it. Bangkok. Bangkok. Yeah. Bang-gong. Oh, that good one's good too. That shit's great. I mean, I said also yeah. good. Oh, like, um, I, there's no way I could pick a top five. Bangkok. Bangkok. Go crazy. Bro. It is top five. You guys have the the five. spicy conch, or was it? Um, fuck. What was it called? How she know more about your food no, than no, you? No, you might have to skip me, bro. I, I <clears> like everything. I like, like I like dogs. my mom used to cook good balu lak. I like catching. Ke- Wait, you gotta explain. Uh, balu lak uh, is like shaking beef. Okay, that sounds fire. Really yeah, good. Catching. Oh, you remember take hot dog, bro? Like, yeah, like, with the eggs. Yes, like, yeah, like, like, everything is uh tikka, and then catching is like it's like fish, but it's like sauce on it, and mm. like I don't know, man. It's I feel like, like food just tastes like home. Like it, it warms well, for yeah. you, of course. Yeah, yeah. I mean, put anything in a microwave, it will warm your soul up. Catching, tikka, uncock. Fa, boom away. That's me. Yeah, boom tell away. me, tell me that little bowl of uh, what'd you eat at my house? Nui, tell me Nui. that they make you Nui feel is good fire. too. Like, but well, of course it does for you guys because you're Vietnamese. Mm. You know, if I you will say the if best you didn't grow up eating Vietnamese food, right. you know, it it'll be a whole new experience for you. No, the best pho I ever had was his mom's pho. That's really. Was really good. I've never really had homemade good. pho. Home, homemade pho is always better. <laughs> really good. Always, always I've never had better. Pho either. I've never had always homemade, I've had homemade pho. The difference between homemade pho and like, yeah, like, like restaurant pho is literally night and day. Yeah. You would know. I, I would know if any of my Vietnamese friends would invite me over to have pho just one day. I was to say that. But when you go to Houston, there's the like, the best in the U.S. He said, when you go to Houston, I thought he was going to invite you over. He's like, yeah, go, he's go like, somewhere he's like, else. Yeah, go buy this shit over here. <laughs> Houston Can't got the over. best, bro. <laughs> Anyways. And what did y'all think of that crawfish place we had? Oh, we love that, that shit. Bomb. Is there any love crawfish better shit. in like in like Cali area? No, no. no. They don't oh, my God. They have, they, have here is they have boiling crab, which is the whitest it's, like crawfish. It's, it's we call it boiling crap. That's okay, that's yeah, that's that, that low key like sad as my heart. Yeah. Trust, I mean that's why when we went out there we're like we have to. Can we go? This. We every time we come to Houston we one million crawfish percent cafe. crawfish cafe was so. Last gas. time we went we finished what four bags? Four bags. It's like At least. we had four like pounds. six seven pounds. We had to order more. Alrighty, mm-hmm. yeah. top five Vietnamese dishes. Just list them. Bang 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 bang. Pho bùm ở quê? Bánh ướt. Bánh ướt. That literally just means like wet something. Um, okay. Wait, what? I don't know. Um, <laughs> Bangkok is more like a delicacy, Bun-cock. but it's one of it's one of the most favorite things I've eaten. Bangkok will go crazy too. Bangkok is pretty good. Bun-cock? It's the yellow. Bangkok is I that yellow Korea. like. It's like an Nina, please stop crunchy. talking. Jesus Bun-cock. Christ! I just heard Bangkok. I can't. Moments. I think that's it. You have one more, man. Uh, oh, you could you could say Bansei O is your fifth one. No, it's not. You didn't even say Fa yet. Did you say? Yeah, fa? I did. Oh. Uh, 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 there's a steamed fish dish. I can't remember what it's called. It's with uh, 
uh, glass noodles. Y'all know what I'm talking about? Mian? Yeah, but it's it's with fish too. It's like garlic fish. I think it's just get hard, bro. Yeah. How come none of you guys said banh mi's? Banh mi's are amazing. They're not that good. I feel like those are like too bready. So banh mi is like something you get like just as a quick like meal. Yeah, yeah. it's almost I like almost like shit. fast food. You know what I've noticed is Jeremy has a white palate. A white palate? Yeah. A white palate. Jeremy got a white man's palate. Like ranch? Hey, we we should say some good ranch. stuff about white people oh before God. the show ends. Huh? We should say ranch. some good stuff about white people. Yeah, let's let's show. go down the line. People, go down okay. the line. Yeah, say some shit. <laughs> go down I think I think white people of all the races are far by by far the friendliest. The friendliest? Yeah. Uh, I don't think so. <clears throat> you, don't, you don't remember slavery? <laughs> all right. Well, I don't remember. I don't I'm not, I'm not oh about my to gosh. judge the white people really? of today on colonization. The, yeah, I that's how friendly people. they were. They started pulling up everywhere like, hey, <laughs> hey it's yeah. mine now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <this> blanket full <laughs> of disease. I'm talking about white people today. Like, yeah, you yeah. don't go, you go, that's what, like, the example I gave. Like, you go to an all Asian club, an all black club. Uh. Like, all white places are the only places where non, people of, like, not their race kind of, like, even go to ever, you know? They're kind of like, ashamed of being white now well, these days. Yeah, most people are They're ashamed like, oh to be. Oh my god, white. that's so white of me, and I'm like, bitch, what the fuck? Yeah, they, it's like, and I hate that, that shit when they talk down on themselves. Yeah. It's like enough people do it. Well, like, I feel don't. like you were dissing me, saying I got a white palette. Well, that okay, because that's what the white, 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 white people diverse, have blander palettes. You guys, it depends on where. I don't know when I've ever turned out food. I've been putting you guys out. Yeah, they have good cuisine, hot dogs. He's like, I want to go eat this ice, this gelato. Gelato's Italian. You guys ever heard of Chick Fil A? Let's eat this smashed burger. I ate the spicy. Spicy chicken sandwich. He's like, what you guys put in this ketchup? <laughs> Tomatoes. That's too spicy for me. I get acid reflux. He said salt and pepper. <laughs> but, uh, anyways, top five Korean foods. I'll start. Um, Solongtang. Solongtang. Yeah. Kalbi jjim is pretty good. Kalbi jjim is up there. What no. is that? I would say kalbi jjim is like a braised. It's what you get at Solongtang with the flames. Are we doing like yeah. a collective Wait, five? That's where you took us the other day, right? Yeah. Are we doing a collective oh, five? Yeah. Uh, tokuk. Fuck no. <laughs> it's good, but it's not in the top five. Okay. Top five for well, me. I'll just start listing a lot of stuff. Okay, so Kalbi, there's just kalguksu. overall Kalbi in general. Yeah. So the kalguksu. 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 Kalbi is Korean marinated short ribs. Mm. It's usually most people's favorite thing at Korean barbecue. True. God, there's so Fuck, many. What did I pick so far? Is there's good. kimchi jjigae is bomb. Yeah, I wouldn't put that top five though. No. Tenjang jjigae? No. <clears throat> I'll, take, I'll take sundubu I way before. Sundubu. Okay. I put sundubu I'll take sundubu there. before. What is that, four? What about pork belly? Oh, no, that's just like a Bosam? meat, dude. Posam with like the, the, the shrimp paste and all that shit. Posam's and wrap bomb, in the yeah. Thing. Posam's bomb. I don't know what none of this. Oh, I'll, I'll take uh, we naengmyeon. We were, naengmyeon? I was about to say, but <laughs> naengmyeon is Korean cold buckwheat noodles. But a lot of people don't that's like it because it's cold like noodle. <laughs> you know what's ass? What do you, what you, guys, you guys be eating? What is bumble way? It's got fucking pig blood in it and shit. That shit's good. Yeah. Don't do that. You can take all that I, out. All I eat is like kimchi and rice. Like what? You yeah. love that shit. No, oh, you know I don't. The, the, you like the, the actual mm -mm. theme of this episode is, is a boxing match. Put them on right now. Bitch versus Korean. Wait, how many of us are there? Who culture y'all think is? Y'all are all first generation, right? Or first generation is you were born here. Yeah, yeah right. Yeah. No, I, I'm an immigrant. I moved uh, here. Really? From Korea? Okay. How old? Right, well, let's just say technically you first generation. Uh, I'm not though. We're I'm not? fresh okay, off that boat. Okay, never mind. Never mind. <laughs> but how old? All right, are you? At all the first generation, who culture is stronger, Viet or Korean? Like who? Which who kids? Actually, I think it's both. They're both pretty similar in my opinion. I don't know. Kim no, Jong Un trained them to be pretty like, strong. Who, who, who least like? Who gets less whitewashed? I feel like both of them get equally whitewashed. You know who I? True. You know I think. You know You know which race is superior at keeping their culture, the Jews, because they oh do. Oh God, they're so good at that. Yes, because what they do oh, is word shit like that. I what? I never met a Jew. The, no, the birthright. Oh. Do you know what birthright is? I've no. never if seen you're a Jewish, Jew in real life. If you're Jewish, or you even go through. Uh, <laughs> are, you, are, you, are you Jewish? No. Okay. No, I no, you no, no, I no, you're you. wrong. You're wrong. Here's why. So if you if you're a, if you're not born Israeli or you're not let's say you're not bloodline Jew, but you go do uh, you go through the process of becoming Jewish, you get a free trip to Israel. And the they, fuck? And they, it's yeah, like two weeks right. long. What? Birthright. Birthright. And they you could be at any age. It's up to thirty five for free, paid. And everybody I'm going, that I'm goes, Jewish. you get it. You get a <laughs> try. They they take you around in groups, and you get it. You just get to see the entire country. They show you the the, the land sites. It's a genius marketing move by the Jewish community because everybody's like, wow. By the government of Israel. It's, yeah, it's smart. It's smart. And everybody and that's born in America goes. 
and then they come back to America and they feel more connected to their homeland. Damn. And yeah, I Amer- think I'm Jewish. Uh, American Jewish people have the strongest ecosystem because everything is hired within or used yeah. within. They have their own ambulances, like they can't use normal ambulances. Yeah. Yep. Everything. And, then, and then also Orthodox Jews are, are the like the the most. Uh, what you call it? Strict with their religion. They're the ones that walk on Sunday or Saturdays. With the curly fries. Cur- yeah. The curly fries. Yeah, they curly have hair. Pits, curly pits. curly hair. They yeah. wear suits and they, you know, they're they're very like strict with it. So you have that, and then you have the more Americanized ones. But they're all are, they're all you know just very proud of yeah, their country. Very. Yeah, they actually, are, they are really good at it. Even when it's like blazing hot, they're wearing their. Mm-hmm. They're very on point. But it that. is. It, I mean, they have the religious aspect to it as well. Like so, you could say that about you know Muslim people are very devoted to their religion, but um, the Jews are just kind of different because it's both like ethnicity as well as religion. So I think it's more well funded. Don't they wear that little cap? Very 100%. well funded. But I mean, it's a, well it's a super smart way to spend like some of your co- country's tax dollars. I think Korea is very good at it too. Korea invested heavily into exporting culture rather than like product. And now if you, you know, who really made Asians cool? Was it y'all? Bitch. Was it y'all? I think so. It was the Chinese. It was, it was mm. Samsung refrigerators. Yeah, yeah, y'all got that K-pop oh, shit, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, we'll, give that, we'll give that to y'all. Y'all got y'all that, that K-pop. The Japanese were trying, you know, they, but they, they, they That's why it. K-pop is so big, like, uh, a lot of a lot of anime is yeah. Korean, isn't it? Or is it no, Japanese? It's Japanese. Japanese, Japanese, but there Japanese. is Korean uh, version that's called Manhua. That's like God Manhua. of High School, uh, Tower of God. Yeah. Oh, really? Yeah. Some yeah. That's Korean? Korean? Those are Koreans. Yeah. Manhua is Chinese. Those are like my favorite. Oh, that's Chinese too? Yeah, Manhua is Chinese. Is that God of High School? Too? Wait. Yeah. Koreans. Oh. Hey. Yes, Korean. we in, in 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 pop culture, you know how, so like Japanese have Power. anime. Yeah. Koreans have K-pop. K-pop. What do Vietnamese have? Drugs, Drugs Bumbo- gangsters. What did you say? You guys do. You guys are a little bit of like underworld. Because in in Vietnam, what I realized, we're still developing the, the jungle. Uh, this is not even trying to like more geographically. The jungle is where like drug trade. Like think of like Americas, right? Where do they grow the drugs? Like mm. the Amazon, New right? So it's like Gold. Colombia, <laughs> Brazil. That a lot of that shit happens. The Asian version is literally like Vietnam, Thailand, and yeah. I would say Viet people got businesses. businesses. businesses are, what's your uh, nail salons? People. I say nail salons. Yeah, nail salons. Is a big what's, one. The, what's the drug trade in Vietnam? Is it mainly like we? Hey, you gotta look. Uh, watch that. Watch this know, Korean man. drama called so. uh, City Hunter. And in Dude, the beginning, that's my favorite. Fucking for real. Lee Min Ho. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh my god, bro, that bro. shit went stupid. And is that, uh, is that your type? Yo, no, because all I heard for one whole summer was that one fucking movie. What, uh, Parasite? <laughs> no, uh, the Lehman Home movie, the City Hunter. No, City Hunter is a series. It's yeah, a it's drama. Like, it's like a TV show, no? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. all I heard for one whole summer, all my friends were talking about this. I'm like, bro, like, never that's touched it. When you were younger, up. right? That's an old yeah. one. Yeah. Yeah, that like shit was so ago. fire. And that's where I learned that, like, oh, shit. Growing up, I was like, Asians don't do drugs. And uh, then I saw oh, them growing nah. drugs in Thailand. And Dude, I'm like, whoa. The first time I went to a rave was so many Vietnamese people. And I was like, yo, this is where the Asians party. Yeah. What? Yeah, they love the etasi. <laughs> Peter Griffin and it's that Vietnamese dub. That's oh, oh, We was sub-dog. hanging with him Ooh. yesterday. Sup dog. Who the fuck is that? <laughs> He's, he, <laughs> that's his name, the one that dubs the, <laughs> oh, really? the Simpsons. Yeah, yeah that should be yeah. correct. Like the Naruto, he'd be like, Shane Marie. Hey, turn up the music. All right, we have one more game before we wrap this up. It's called right. Truth, Actually, Dare, or Drink, featuring Nectar Heart Seltzer. Hey, before we get into this, can I say something? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, you know that phrase you always say, ham choy? Yeah. I'm going to teach you a new one, and you have to say this all the time. What is it? Gongak. Gongak? Oh, yeah. Yeah, you what is get, gongak? You don't get a... Uh, what is gongak? It means like, let's go. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Turn up. People going to hug you. Really? Like, it's just like... Heartfelt. You know I'm just going to go off the top with the dough. It's like when you meet another Vietnamese, it just kind of shows that, hey, like... We're brethren. It is. Yeah. It's like, what's, it's like my bro. It's like gongak. Why do I feel you know like this is some bullshit? Why? I don't. I don't know why. Why do I feel like they're trying to psych me up into some shit? Yeah. They're going to okay. I'm not saying that hey, shit ever again. Gong-gack. You got me fucked up. It's time to try from now on. All right. Uh, do you guys both have enough seltzer in your? Yes. Wait, real quick. What's a ham choy? Ham choy. It's a hang choy. Say it in your it's like a, mic. It's like a ham dish. Yeah. That like they eat as a sandwich with it, a ham dish. You, Oh. It's like a sandwich with a ham dish. Ham inside. joy. Ham it literally dish. just means like you you like to party. Like yeah. you like to play. That's all you much. do. You in, play. In, in, like you'll give up like like your academics or your business to go out and party. Oh, you're a ham choy. 
Ham joy. All you want to do, all you want to do is have fun. Ham joy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We have a question. What is that one dish where it's like kind of a snack? So it's like raw pork and it has raw garlic and like jalapenos in it. You hungry? God, I know what she's talking about. Raw you know what I'm talking about? Oh, in the in the little cakes. And and yeah, it's like in like little know, rectangles. Yeah, yeah, that shit is about. so good. Fuck. I used to eat that all the time. And then they wrap it in foil or like just. Mm, yep, yep, yep. That shit is so good. What are we doing? What is that called? With Casamigos. There has to be a pain. For yeah, there has to be pain. Oh, that's true, like, actually. Three earlier. Otherwise, she will have to say three. Danny, have you had another shot yet? He said three. Watch out. Huh? He stole it? Wait, wait. Come join the truth or drink. Danny, come join. Danny, just join us for the drink and challenge. Can Danny come for the truth or drink? Yes. Danny can come. No, no, no. Let's. No, you Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't worry. Oh, who is Who talk? Who talk? Do you have a crush on my aunt? Who's your aunt? Danny. Oh, 100%. Okay. Oh, wow. Yeah. I just, I I'm just, not Nina. You think I would lie on okay. camera for views? This is why I fuck with you, bro. Straight to the point. Okay, period. What do you like about her? Huh? What's not to like? Name three most. Yeah, like name your, name your five favorite qualities. Hey, what the fuck? This, uh, this, this was a game about y'all. I'm hey, talking about you. Answer the questions. My five? Let's, let's start with three. Okay. Top three, and I'll need two more after that. Five. Okay, I guess fine. She's okay, pretty. Five. She's thoughtful. She's pretty. She's beautiful. She's hot. No, I'm kidding. Wow. <laughs> okay, obviously she's beautiful. That's one, right? Two, she's very caring. She's a very like motherly, like take care of people figure. Uh -huh. I like that. Three, she's very smart. She's done many impressive things in her life. Fair. Four, she cares about... Uh, hold on. Scratch that one. I'm gonna take oh, he's about to say something. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to scratch that one. Uh... <laughs> Four, she works out a lot, and I I need that in a in a partner the, for the rest of my in a life. Partner, Wait, what? Yeah, partner. somebody that I plan to marry. So. Partner. Oh, oh, you hear marriage? that? Number five. I don't know. She's funny sometimes. <laughs> she's funny. She's a cool guy. She makes me laugh well, sometimes. She's a Gemini. She is Once funny. or twice in my life. You a Gemini? Yeah, I am. Yeah. Me too. Oh shit. Four uh, Gemini's. Like, hey, this is I was like, I, I found it in a female yeah. form. <laughs> What? There's four Gemini's? <laughs> kind of tripping yeah. me out. You literally wow. found... What are you guys? What are you guys? You found, you found Actually, do you guys know horoscopes like that? I know horoscopes Okay, what do you think I am? <laughs> You're a Virgo. How did you know? I just know. Yeah, you... you Really? Wait, yeah. they knew I was a Wait, Virgo. Jeremy? Nobody ever knows. Jeremy's a, Jeremy's a Sagittarius. You're Pisces. You're fuck... You, 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 you looked up our shit. He's Pisces. Yes. Well, how oh, did you shit. know? I just thought he was Pisces. What about... What about you already know who he is. We'll talk. Gemini. No, no. He's zesty. Oh yeah, you are pretty selfish, Leo. Yeah, it's literally my birthday today. That's true. That is, it is his birthday. You be honest. Did you look it up? Or I did not look you it up. Really think that I promise we're... you, I did not. I don't have that on my phone right now. Yeah, what the fuck is happening? Hey, can we don't get try, the game? Don't, don't try to escape this game. Okay, go ahead. Let's All right, this game. game is called Truth or Drink, and we're playing right, it with Nina host, and Peter. Who talk? We're starting this game now. Truth or Drink. You know, Nina, I'm understanding why Vit was getting mad. Let me talk. How about that? Huh? I actually, it's I hate turn. being interrupted. Uh, I I look at each other. You're gonna face each other while you play this game. Look into each other's eyes. This game. Yes, and make sure you're talking to the mic when you talk, though. Talk to the mic when you talk though. Grab the mic, grab the mic, hold it. Yes, there you go. Grab your drink that I poured Casamigos in so it's not an easy All right. choice. All right. Peter? Yes. All right. Back up a little bit, just a little bit. Now, now I want you guys, don't play no character. Hey, Peter, Okay. no characters being played. Nina, no characters being played. All right, bet, bet Honest, bet. and you get to choose to drink or tell the truth, okay? All right, bet. Wait, Nina why is it just us two? Yeah, it's why just is it just two. us two, first of all? Because you guys are best friends. Yeah. It makes sense. Yeah, just, just, just you'll see. Bro, first of all, I'll do whatever I want with my legs. All right, come on. All right, Nina. Okay. Have you ever found Peter attractive? No. Uh, uh, all right, yeah, no, we can't, we can't, we can't, we can't clown truth? you for your answers. True. On but, your he's, but, he's, but he's objectively attractive. Hold on, hold on. On your mother's life. I think physically, I don't even know what I really like. To mm. be honest, okay. So I can't say confirmly. That's it. <laughs> Look at Bachi's face. Hey, Bachi, stop. Drink, drink the drink, Bachi, Nina. Stop. Just drink the drink. No, drink. I promise. All right, fine. We'll okay, move on. Personality, then okay. Yeah. Oh, oh, okay. What? Okay, what? Okay, what? He has an attractive personality. Uh, okay, fine. You know what? Cop out. Peter, have you ever found Nina attractive? Absolutely. <laughs> No, physically, personality, and truth. This is not good. Truth. Um, are you guys dating? No. 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 Oh. Sadly. Sad. 
One day, maybe. No. Have you ever imagined Peter naked? <laughs> no, actually, no. Have you ever seen Peter naked? <laughs> <laughs> actually, no. Take a shot. Peter, Not have, fully. Peter, have you ever, uh, the vice versa? Absolutely. <laughs> no. Wait, seen her or imagined? Im- imagined. Oh, no. Oh. oh what? <laughs> Wait, what? What? Next, next question. What? <laughs> what the fuck? You heard it. You heard it. Just like. Okay. Okay. Would you ever? Do you think that relationships are better off as friends first? Yes, hundred percent. Me too. Mm. That's something I, I just switch switch stances on. Really? Yeah. All right, well, side 100%. tangent. Why? Uh, I mean, before, like the way I went about like talking to girls or something like that, it was really bad. Like I see a girl as attractive. And I be, like physically attractive, and I try to convince myself that I like her. So like I just try to talk to her right off the bat because she's fine. So then you slide in, you talk. Instead of like now, it's like very like everything for me. I need it to be platonic at first, and let me fall in love with your character. But it's like, but I still gotta make sure all the platonic relationships are like they gotta be still physically attractive. Mm-hmm. But it's just more like you can't give that extra until you get to know them a little bit. Yeah, that's good. I mean, for me, it's the same thing. Uh-huh. It's just like. Like looks, it's great. You know, have them right now. But like, mm-hmm. this this someone you're generally potentially like oh. having a long term something with. Like, you have to make sure. Oh my uh, god, oh my god. Hey Nina, truth or drink? Uh, is it attractive when, when when a man almost chokes out his drink? Uh, yes. It is. Oh. She likes anything that's like abusive. Yeah. <laughs> Low key. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Sadistic. Uh, Sadistic. <laughs> Peter, do you right. like it when your woman takes charge? Um, I think right and right is right and wrong is wrong. So it's like as long as as long as whoever I'm with has the humility and like that's the awareness. The to yeah, that's not the sh- question, man. Wait, I, you like it when she takes charge or what? It sounds like he's throwing shots or something. I don't fucking know. But yeah, go like ahead. Like to get your legs lifted up or what? Yeah. Yeah. I feel like, yes or I feel no? like if she's in the right, yes. But you I'm talking about pin you against the wall, pick oh, you up. Are talking about like that? Yes. Oh, we're talking about this this morning. Oh, um, he was getting deep. We like to, we like to do. I like duality. Like as much as like. Oh, you you like to girls, switch back and forth. Girls like to instigate. Sometimes I like it when the girl instigates too. Mm. I'm also a switch. Okay, cool. Oh, cool, switch. Cool. Okay. Switch is such a funny word. Nina, do you prefer your man to take charge, or do you like to take charge? Mm, half, half. Good answer. You could do that. Not a good answer. Shut up. Half half. Damn, why is everyone half half? Because we're switchers. Oh, no. yeah, there's no way that I, all I, everyone just is like. But you like doing 50. the same thing every day. I just like, don't like a guy that's like always well, has to be dominant. It's not about the same thing. Yeah. Like we know you're a guy already. You don't need to. How about how about what do you like it? more of instead mm. of half half? More yeah, yeah. Because there's always a lean. It's like yeah. everyone does like to switch it up, but there is no nothing's fifty percent. I like 50%. it when it's like almost like a competition. Oh, you like to fight. <laughs> She wants to feel like she's fighting for her life. It's like a competition, you know what I'm saying? That's it. It's just like it's plain if it's just that. Like if it's just uh-huh. that, it's like two animals fucking each other. Wait, we're talking about sex right now? Yeah. Is that it though? Fuck oh, you. okay. I would say I'm more submissive. I lean more towards submissive if I have a girlfriend. Uh, he likes to be okay. pinned on the wall. Okay. Because it's so rare to find, find, a, find a woman that takes charge. I think it's more rare. I think it's more hot. And then if, like, day to day... I would assume I'm the one normally in, in, in decision making, I'll be the one to be like, we're doing this, we're doing this. Right. If I found a woman that could be like, like my, my biggest pet peeve is say like I asked you, what do you want to eat? You're like, I don't know. And I give you the, an option, you're uh, like, no. Oh, yeah. You give want you another to be one. Like, I want this. Yeah, hey, just like, bro, right. sometimes in your life, just say what you want. It's cause and there's just a day you're always in control. So yes. like when it comes to that, you you like not being in control. I also just like women that can literally beat the fuck out of me. Oh damn! That's a lie. Wait, 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 hold on. How come he didn't like that one girl? Like, yeah, wait, hold on. There was a girl that was literally beating the fuck out of him to flirt with him, and he was like, "No, no, no." There's a difference. Like There's a difference. They need to be hot. They need to be hot. They one, they need to be hot, and two, I need to be in love with you. Wait, was she not hot? She was okay. All right, uh, Peter, rate your stroke game out of ten. Stroke game. Uh, I'm beyond. Damn. All right, ten. But I feel like I shouldn't be talking about this because my mom be. So drink, man. Your mom's watching. No, you we have that, no, you we have meant, that option. Wait, no, we meant swimming. Yeah. Backstroke. What are you talking about? Uh, my dad taught me how to swim when I was a kid. <laughs> and uh, I would consider my stroke game a 10. Butterfly, freestyle, all that. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Nina, what is one mistake that you still feel guilty about? 
Ooh. In general, in life? In life. Ooh. What's one mistake? Hurting Peter? No, <laughs> that, that one, no. Oh. No, that one, no. That's not a regret. <laughs> uh, she meant it. Shit. I think my one mistake was uh, telling my dad that he's useless. Oh. And he's not my dad. Oh, that's that, one big mistake. It's like a whole drama just unfolded. Said. Damn. Do you want to go into that or you want to move on? Actually, two mistakes. I'm not even going to lie. Oh, okay. I think the other one was beating on my brother. That's oh. it. That's Wait, something every I day would, or I should, like just in or like general? beat him up real bad or like. Yeah. Like, yeah, it was just not good. Like uh, my intentions were good, but I was also a kid trying to like teach another kid. Is he yeah. younger? Younger. Uh, yeah. I've, beat I've my talked brother about this before, times. but it's just like that's something that I never felt like was right. It's just I don't know how to express before. I didn't really know how to express. Did you talking. beat him up once though? Like really bad? Is that? It was like years. And like, oh, beating them up constantly. Yeah, oh. and, it was, and it became this thing where like my pride got involved, mm. so my ego was like a big yeah. drive. Is he still scared of you? No, not anymore. Okay, we're like chill now. Mm. I see, I see. But like even then, like I think the worst part I knew I fucked up was like we were laughing at a joke, and I never joke around with him. But when I finally did, mm. he was scared to laugh. And oh. then I was like, oh, I fucked up. Yeah. Oh, that's so you, sad. You realize like that, the long lasting damage. When I knew damage. that he looked at me when he was about to laugh and he oh, didn't mine. know whether it was wrong or not, I was like, damn, like. Oh. I fucked up really yeah, bad. That was sad. And that is like, a little sad. Yeah, I yeah. That. And I was like, damn, like I'm, like I'm a piece of shit, you know, like. Not a piece of shit, but you learn now. Yeah, of course. Like it's the only way to fix it, right? Just yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's it. And your relationship damn. with your father. Oh, me and my dad, we're like bros. We just oh, fucking see? throw chairs and punch each other all the time. But we you regret just... it because it was out of a place of, you were like being real about that? I was being like a kid, mm. you know what I'm saying? But it yeah. was, I mean, it is true. Mm-hmm. It is true. He's pretty fucking useless. <laughs> but like, um, he still, he loves me. You know, he loves me like that, so I see it. Damn. It seems like both relationships have been mended, so it, it's a yeah. It's, mm. a it's always a guy, problem with guys. It's always I feel like it's a pattern, though. You hurt the people you love the most. <laughs> Don't repeat the pattern. Maybe yeah. break Actually, the pattern. No, I think that's no. why you refuse to to bring Peter in. You're scared. You don't want to hurt him because you yeah. love him. That's too why much. I. That's why I don't date. So mm. I think I break break see. the pattern. Mm. Well, well, the, yeah. well, for me, it's just like I'm really picky, so it needs to be everything is on the yeah, What is he everything. lacking? What, what is, is yeah, What is the everything? Can yeah, you yeah, truth or dra- yeah. What, what's truth Peter there? No. What's no. What's what, Peter? What's Peter lacking in your standards? In my standards. Um, nothing at all. I don't know what you're talking about, Bachi. She, she gonna try to make up something. Yeah, she's making something up right now. Hey, Bachi, if if what she's saying is not true about Peter, please say it into the mic. I will. Okay, bet. But you gotta pick first. Um, <laughs> Trishan? Ooh, is that true, Bachi? I want to consider it Trishan. It's just like he's, you know what I'm saying? He's a young man. You know what I'm saying? He wants to just... It's sounding <laughs> like you're Trishan, Mr. Peter. I'm on, actually, I'm on Peter's side on this. If the woman of my dreams told me no, I would move on with my life. I'd continue okay. living my life. Okay. Oh, shit. That just means you don't want it bad enough, so it's cool. Oh! oh. I know my worth. I don't oh, wait, chase. I have a truth hey, or drink. So you don't have no, to actually, have it. No, that's not even a truth or drink. Actually, it is. But I want her. Well, that's too bad to act like it. Have okay. you, you don't have to tell the audience, but okay, if you don't want to, but have you ever asked Nina out officially? No. Say that into the Yeah, mic. yeah, why are you being shy? <laughs> no, 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 we, no, I have not. Oh, no wonder mm. she doesn't want oh. you. All jokes aside, all jokes aside, we do a lot of business together. We're yeah. really good friends. Yes, mm. yes. And I met her at a, like, a really weird part of my life. You know what I mean? So it's like. She's a really good friend of mine. She, I know she has a crush on me, but like, no. Uh, <laughs> right, let's stop. But, let's stop this shit, please. But please. In all honesty, this is please, truth or like, drink, okay? Jesus. This is truth. This is truth. This is truth. It's not very, it's not very honest. I think y'all should take my my word over hers because I'm like, no, I don't think so. I just slammed like four shots. I wouldn't lie to you. <laughs> <laughs> all right, you wouldn't even lie but, what he was saying. Okay, but I'm being honest. I, I, I've never seen Peter live here. Yeah, yeah. but, so but in all honesty, yeah. like. I told her like, "Hey, we should wait like two, three years." No, you know I'm I mean? <laughs> like, hey, wait, 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 <laughs> Mr. Peter, why would you wait two, three years? Is it because you're treasure? Why would I wait two, three years? Hey, we're asking the question okay, to Peter. Guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so you're Wu Talk, Peter, and Nina. All right, he can go. He can go first. Then fuck it, I'll go after. What was the question? And Nina starts answering all the questions yeah. at all three. I will. She's schizophrenic. <laughs> <laughs> talking to herself. Peter, <laughs> so why you want to wait two, three years? Is it because you're treasure? No, not at all. Actually, actually, uh, this is like my year that I've kindly, finally like started like fixing myself 
and like not really interested in that type of stuff anymore. You know what I mean? Best mindset to be in. Exactly yeah. right. So I've like, never felt more fulfilled than I'd have in the past few. Especially, months. it's like it, everything's lined lines up because every single time I talk to you, you on the same wavelength via everybody. It's like everybody's like even I like I hang out. Y'all met Michael. Yeah. Same thing. Like everyone's kind of on the same wavelength right now. So I'm around a lot of good influences. Everyone. Men are me. finally starting to value themselves. Right. Like don't yeah. go through that shit. Don't do that to yourself. Like, bitch, even if you're young, like having fun is not worth Period. it. So it's like, yeah. I just feel like right now is my time to build up genuine relationships. Everything needs to be very platonic before I just dive into anything. Mm. Smart so like, man at 22. I agree. Long, at 22, I wasn't thinking like that. How long does a relationship need to be platonic? Two, three years sounds like a long ass time. To, like I could. Get to know somebody in six months, probably. Oh, two, three years is just because I feel like Nina is a little bit younger than me. What so the she, fuck? She, I'm by a year? What? She, got, fuck? she got a little bit of growing to do. Mm. I don't know, I don't know what the hell you're talking about. New York decided, City 22 uh, is different than Texas 22. We oh. started like a business relationship together, so I feel mm. like when business is involved, you got to take things even more slow. You know what I mean? So it's like That's you true. Can't dive into that anything. Part of yeah, that part like, is just... Yeah. Cute. That was that Thank was you. honestly very well said and adorable. Thank you. Thank you. I hope you guys get married one I day. I still like Nina, but no. yeah. Now kiss. Yeah. <laughs> now kiss. Now kiss. Truth or dare yeah. or drink. Yeah, yeah. That's just dating. It's That's just, just dare or dare. Kiss dare or kiss drink. twice. <laughs> <laughs> Which one? <laughs> That's, that's just dating. We still hook up and shit. Uh -huh. like, uh, like, no. <laughs> incorrect. That is incorrect. Bachi, do you confirm? We still make up Bachi, you drunk. better not play that shit. Be Bachi, fucking do you truthful. confirm? What Be is the word truthful, when you say bro. when you don't want to? You, you plead the fifth. I plead the I plead fifth. The fifth. Yeah. Be fucking Be truthful. Fifth. Yo. Hey, Bachi. Bachi now? Plead the fifth. Well, I, well you know, you're, you're in LA right now. Have you been a good boy in LA, Bachi? Um, I was on bad timing, but I have been a good boy. <laughs> What does bad timing mean then? If you're being I, a good I came, boy? I came with like the bad, like the wrong intentions. Uh, he was trying to fuck. He couldn't find anything. Say how it is. Nah, bro. not like that. Bro. <laughs> say it how it is, Bachi. Why he said that? Nah, it was not it's like how that. The game goes. <clears throat> it's just too many people around. Yeah. Nah, it's just. <sighs> Wait, question, question. Yeah, for real. Why you did that to him? Finer girls in LA or finer girls in Texas? Stop oh, it. Good question. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Come on, just Texas. Oh. They got what? Angus. Hey, Bachi, I looked at you like, nah, oh, dude. I thought, I thought nah, nah. You said Kelly. LA? Kelly, for sure. Crazy. What do you think? Oh. LA. Yeah, LA. Crazy. Something about the California sun. I think New York. Bro, like, Texas girls different. eat, like, New York. like, organic beef and <laughs> shit. You always pick a new she option. Roars. <laughs> yeah. She roars. New York, New York. Well, it's because I have a particular type in, in, in Houston. That's just, What's your what type? Yeah. Just Asian girls. There's a lot of Asian girls in Houston. I mean, Houston, yeah, but like, bro, oh my. Where, where, where are you coming with these third options? <laughs> Wait, you gotta go to you gotta go to OC, Orange we County. Oh, we that's, we love OC. That's we love OC. Yeah, we love OC. Exactly. We that's, where all, OC. that's where all the really pretty Vietnamese girls are. That's all the VSB. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm serious. Best Vietnamese. So if you want food, a toxic girls, woman to ruin your life, someone to, to run OC. you over in a car. Yeah. OC. In a car. Go to OC. Or you could get a nice Korean woman who'll just beat you in public. That's even nicer, actually. <laughs> no, actually, both of them are toxic. I agree. Would yeah. you get a Chinese? Just I'd rather get hit by a fist than a car. Yeah. <laughs> let's uh, let's wrap it though because we've been filming filming for a minute. Our very lovely guest. Do you want to plug anything? Let's start with Mr. Bachi. YouTube at Bachi. A what? Wait. Oh uh, wait. Okay, Peter, go. Uh, sorry, sorry. Uh, thank you guys for having us. Plug in Nectar Seltzer and Super Bonsai. Happy birthday, Wu Talk. Where my man Aww. is. Yeah. That was cute. Thank you, Peter. No, no, no. This is your time to plug whatever you want. Don't don't worry about don't worry about us, Bachi. Oh yeah. Just YouTube. Okay. Bachi. Um, my name is Nina, and uh if you're not drinking nectar, you're probably a bitch. <laughs> and um if you're not swallowing these pills, you probably can't swallow at all. So <laughs> just go die. And uh that's it for the day. My name is Nina. Go joke off. Bye. <laughs> hey, and if you want, that. and if you want, we are filming original content. We're switching up our strategy on fourth wall. We filmed the entire Super Bonsai launch party. We're gonna drop, obviously, like a condensed version for YouTube, but the full extended cuts will go on fourth wall. So if you want to see like actual vlog footage, think of Nectar vlogs, but longer, way better produced, etc. All then, unedited, all natural. We're um, leaving in every slur that Vitz says, every know, single one. I don't know I about say better edited. That's kind of messed up. Got to be working my ass off, man. 
Well, you don't even be editing them. Warren, you do a good job. Wow. You but you only have about 90 seconds to make a video. We're talking like 15 minute videos going on there. Yeah, so. Yep. Anyways, Subscribe. thank you so much. Ugh. Oh, wait, what? Eddie got something. I think it's my present. Oh. Oh, oh it's Gucci. Happy oh, birthday. man. Hey, Eddie, Eddie, sit, sit down. Eddie, you gotta sit. You gotta, he you gotta got sit. the goosey. Don't crush this. Big, big goosey. 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 Damn. Tripped out for real. So, so everybody, Eddie makes money now. I don't know if you could tell. All right, we got yeah. it, Eddie. Mm -hmm. You want to just get that? I'm uh, going to go pick it up. I, I, I've been ordered it. I just had to pick it up. Tonight. He proposing. Wow, wow, wow. Okay. <laughs> if it's a ring, you better get on one knee, I swear. Oh, shit, I got to get on one knee. Oh, I knew it was a ring. It's another lion. <laughs> if it's How lion, do you know his ring crazy. size? While he's sleeping? Oh, this shit is hard. This tag must remain attached for exchanges and returns. It is a ring, y'all. Wow. And it fits on his yeah. ring finger. Damn. Read the letter. Read the letter. Read the letter. Oh, he wants it out loud. Where is the letter? It's inside. It's a letter? Oh, no. Hey, what if it's like, yeah, you're a bitch, like, like, you're the pussy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you're the pussoir. Pussoir? Pussoir? Read it, read it, read it. <laughs> this is cute. <laughs> <laughs> read it. It says, happy birthday, brother. My love for you is built like your drip forever. <laughs> I don't even know what that means. Wait, <laughs> I, was just, I just literally had to raise something. We're so forever dripping. That's, wasn't everyone there was no that. effort put into this. That was yeah, effort. He just got you, just got you no, a Gucci I'm ring. I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Is that it? I don't know. I haven't tried to put it on yet. Yeah, how did you know my ring size? <gasps> I was hoping. It fits. I was hoping. Oh, we'll talk, we'll talk. I also have a gift for you, but it's coming. Okay. Yeah, Yay, now we get to stretch my birthday over two episodes. I don't want people coming in the comments like, what did you get? You're just going to not. Kiss him. He's right here. <laughs> and end. Hey guys, we're under the influence. And if you're enjoying our clips and you want to see the full episodes, you can go to our website. We have them all linked to every audio streaming platform and YouTube. If you like, comment, and subscribe over there, it really helps us out. Please, we haven't paid the rent in months. If you're looking for us or any of the guests, we always tag them. Also, if you have any topics or questions you want to ask us, go to our website or text this number on the screen. If you're feeling thirsty, drink Neck Your Hard Seltzer. Seltzer. Delicious Asian flavors and no weird aftertaste. We ship to 45 states. Use code UTI15 at checkout on our website for 15% off your first box. And if you want some of the best bartending tools money can buy, you can use the same code UTI15 on barchemistry.com for 15% off. Thank you guys for your support. We really appreciate it. And if you leave mean comments, please stop. They really hurt our feelings. But if you don't, we love you.